I'm gonna pop the chat out and okay. close the rest of Chrome. Hello, everybody! Capes and Forms. It's Thursday night, live from Chicago and also other places. Uh, I, as always, am Planet Jane, and I am joined by all three of my co hosts this evening. I'm joined by Trevor Whatever. I'm back! Shredney Vashkar. <laughs> and Wynn. Hello? Yes. When I just realized that you are the only one of us who, like, does not have a two-word, like, thing that we use to get introduced with here. Hello is only one word. Well, no, I mean, like, your name. You just win. I'm just win. Just win. Alright. Sci-fi uh, nerd on Twitter. Sci-fi nerd on Twitter. Let me... Yeah. Hello, Chiron HR. Well. Had a well. Oh, that is no. one of my Twitter mutuals. Hello. I don't Hello. Like milk on the rock. How I don't do like we milk. do this? I don't. Milk on the rocks. Gotta like log in to Steam Friends, I think. And then I have you to can find the game. Then you Where can did do I put it? other fun things. Okay, I have the chat up just as the chat now. Just so. as the uh, just the chat. That's that. That should be fine. Hopefully, I think. I have it yeah. locked open. I am right. inviting Trey. Apparently, I'm one of the two right. viewer nows. Go viewer nows. No gi. Accepting an invitation. No gami. Oh my god. Play game. Butchering my own language. Risk. Brutally. You good, Freddy? I'm never good. You're kind of just mumbling to yourself over there. I'm not even mumbling, I'm talking to myself. Mumble oh rapping to himself. Mumble rapping to myself, it's just a. <laughs> something, something, Xanax. You know, no, you need. You, I, but I need, like, a bumpin' beat under me to, like, do it properly. Bump in the night. Bump in the night. The magic card. It's also just like a phrase. Oh, thank no, you for like... the subscription, Trey. Twelve months. That's a year, two, baby. It, it, two of your subs are two of your co-hosts. Yeah, you know. That's how it is in this wild... We support the machine. <laughs> wild quest called Twitch. Did you, uh, and did you, you get the invite never, one? Never, uh, never, never, be more than a machine. The game is loading. Ah, there you go. Now I see it. One time. One time for the one time. The game. Now I, and I don't think Win either, have played since the update, but you have, right, Trey? Oh, there's more characters now. Uh, briefly, briefly, briefly. I need time. to some stuff in the okay. options real quick I need before to we get going. Tray up a little bit also. I'm Maybe actually gonna jump into me to turn everybody up a little bit. Uh not actually, I meant to pick uh what's what's her fucking face? Uh Artificer. That's hmm. difficult to do. Normal. Oh, I forgot that they can't just scale the window, I actually need to yeah. change the resolution. They added a bunch of stuff in this update, but they did, they couldn't fix that, apparently. Um... So... <clears throat> What's on your mind, currently? So, I sort of thought about this, and it's because it was remind- I was reminded of this because I was thinking about, you know, like, actually a couple of things, including our favorite whipping boy. There's our, many our, of those. Logic. No, our favorite. Um, the, the, you don't, know, our, our boy Bobby. Don't say logic, you'll summon Marone. Call me Bobby Kennedy <laughs> no, the way I was I gonna say Meryl that because I was thinking about that, that person, oh, um, I, it reminded me of 
So Chance the Rapper has a new album. We out. can talk about that. And uh, I haven't listened to it yet, but I have heard. I have listened to some of it, and there's a reason I only listened to some of it. Ah, uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, apparently, oh. it is uh, unfortunately not very good. That's disappointing. I, I Let me double found... check my controls. I found myself actually enjoying when it was current. Hey, Enjoying finally... what when it was current? Uh, Chance's previous work. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. Um, I liked Coloring I... Book too. I was one of like five people that liked that album. No, actually, you are. There are people who definitely liked that. Like, um, okay, you, I am ready. I... Actually, um, actually, I remember... Trey, if I could just interrupt you for one second and then yeah. you can finish your thought. Trey, are you like a little bit far from your microphone? Uh, no. Okay, you just sound really quiet for some reason. I can turn you up more, though, so... Do I sound cool. okay? Yeah, you two sound fine. Trey just sounds kind of quiet right now. Mm. Uh, can you say, like, applesauce? Applesauce. Uh, that should be good. Alright, we're, we're good to go. Uh, okay. As you were, Shrek me. But I was gonna say that, actually, because I recently watched, um, uh, Santana's review of The Big Day. Uh-huh. And he was, like, actually Big basically day. saying, you Big know, day. that he had actually <laughs> always, you know, always actually respected Chance, even if he wasn't, you know, a particularly a fan, and that he actually did really like Coloring Book. Uh -huh. um, and that, but he was saying, like, but man, this was him doubling down on every single bad habit he has at once. I Chance mean, the rapper voice my wife. Yeah, like <laughs> Yeah. Like Oh no. If you've seen those memes that are just like, ooh, I love my wife, ooh, that's that's most of the album, which Yeah, that's I know. Not, it's supposed to be played at people's weddings. Apparently. Like that's not a problem in of itself, but No, it's and not just, in and of itself, but Oh there's... we got we got red chests now. What does this mean? But there's a there's a problem when you there's the problem with the way he did it. Yeah. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> I, uh, saw, I, uh, I, I heard I, it described as basically... It's basically like his full-on Christian rap album. Yeah, and it's also <laughs> like really hetero, which those are just two qualities I love I mean, in my music. <laughs> it's very strange. No, no, I know I know what's Christian. on your mind when you're gonna say like isn't most music. And the answer is yes, but not like this. <laughs> Intensely hetero. We were talking the straightest man on Oh, the portal is right here. Oh look at yeah. that. Basically yeah, it basically <laughs> yes, Chance the Rapper has become the straightest man on Earth. <laughs> the straightest oh, gosh. man alive. Wait. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, straighter than Phil Collins? Because <laughs> cause that's pretty straight. I can yes. feel Phil Collins in the air tonight. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Why you gotta do it? Why you gotta be like that? Why you... <laughs> I need an item. Okay, I will uh, let you I have... found... I'm gonna open this 44. Uh, I'm gonna drink. open this 40 and get drunk. Who's playing as what? Oh no, if we decided to become... I'm playing as a... No. Phil we Collins need a, um... is an accomplished drummer and producer. That is he's true. He's sure it. He but... sure is. True. Yeah. Like, Very he's, much so. He's just like, easy to make Like, who should need an energy drink? I don't know, don't worry too much about it. I can move pretty fast to begin with. I'm actually quite I... slow. I think they nerfed... I think I either of them would would maybe benefit from it, but it's okay. I already took I mean it. I No you can you can have I it would I mean I would benefit There's a shop from down here, least a Mountain so. Dew. There's another took, energy drink down here. I, I took it. your fungus uh, I'm gonna <laughs> take so. I just got thrown off cliff. Oh no. And I just. accidentally bought the wrong item. And now you And dead. then I died. God damn it, I can't remember uh, I I'd have to listen to it again and um Risk I was thinking too, everybody the, the song falling from uh, the Twin Peaks soundtrack. But um, <laughs> what I was gonna say is I, I saw somebody on 
the hip hop subreddit, which I still frequent for some fucking reason, uh, <laughs> say that YBN Corday put out a better Chance album than Chance did, which I don't. Disagree that with. surprises me not one bit. Although, I've also been hearing that in the uh, the the recent uh, uh, XXL freshman um, uh, cipher that just you know the 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 three women on there ate everyone's lunch. Jesus Hi, Christ! Dude. I just saw that in the game chat. It says your family will never know how you died. Thanks, game. <laughs> Live from Chicago, it's Thursday night. Yes, it's true. But uh, what were you going to say about that, Jane? Um, I was going to say kind of. I, uh, like, I watched all the XXL ciphers, and I thought Not this the ciphers. I was... Oh, wait, yeah, the ciphers, yes. Sorry. Yeah. Got confused for a second with the, um... The freestyles, which were I don't, a different I don't, thing entirely. I don't watch those. Um, but, um, yeah. like, this year was a lot better than last year's. Mm hmm. Uh, but, like, how I would rank the actual musicians is very different from how I would rank the ciphers. Like, of the people that got in, my favorite one was Tierra Whack, but I didn't like her thing at all. Because she huh. did that thing where they cut the beat off and had her basically oh, yeah. she, just monologue, because, and I don't like that. Yeah, basically she just did, you know, like she did. She was uh, probably for scheduling reasons wasn't able to do a freestyle, so they just had her do the freestyle in the cipher. It. I'm extremely what? good at this video game. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Trey, do you need these mushrooms? I don't actually. I, I already have them. one. All right. Yeah. Take your. Yes. Do you think we should uh, turn the portal on? Um, I'm ready if you are. All right. Let's go. Leroy. <laughs> but um. Fredney, is that you? Yes. Please play us a beautiful song. No, it's loud. Well, we kill this. It's not that loud at all. It it's loud on my end. Ah, uh, I see. <laughs> Sensitivity. Play us a song, it's loud, though. Spiel, man. <laughs> Have I ever told you guys about the greatest uh, forum thread that I was ever a part of? No. Um. Although I would like to first, before you get into that, hear you finish your thought with the overall thing with the Oh, uh, yeah. Like, um. Not counting the people who I can't, like, even really remember what they did, like, Mosey and fucking the, them, uh, like, probably put it, like, Megan, Rico Nasty, the Baby, YBN, uh, I feel like I'm forgetting somebody, Blueface, and then... YK, Osiris, and Mosey at the bottom. Yeah, like, actually, that's really similar to what pretty much everybody, you know, that I, you know, that I've seen is essentially said, although they would, a lot of people are putting Tierra Whack higher. I would. I, I think the, the beat cutting out bothered a lot of people. Like, I, I don't even feel good ranking it with the other ones, because it's a different game. Because it's essentially, it's essentially oh, freestyle, okay. but well, happens to be yeah. in the cypher. I'll take a second one. Please Which bring me back weird. to life. Yeah, we can, we can go. Wake me up. up. Wake Those me up and die. Save <laughs> me from the oh, nothing. I've become. Uh, <laughs> um. Uh. But, good. yeah. Christian New Metal. <laughs> I actually like that song. Fuck you. But um, I have nothing. Again. I would I not nothing. describe Evanescence as Christian new metal. They actually, they actually apparently. I think they, were I think they religious. started as a Christian band or something. I don't remember. Yet. Yeah. But um, I'm not even sure I describe that as new metal myself. But, but um, yeah, they're kind of like it's it's I don't know. They're they they have new metalish elements. They're more gothy overall. I don't know shit about music. I don't know anything about anything. 
Although, if, if you actually want Christian new Metal, that's more like Skillet. Who we've already talked about on the show. Yeah. Who have already admitted to listening to. But, um... Yeah. Uh, I mean... Oh, hey, you, mean like what, you mean like what they cook on? Yeah. Cook on. Uh, that's what we're talking about. <laughs> uh, Get it popping? I, like I mean... Like a skill. Like, in terms of... Like, I've, I've already confessed to being a closet, ambivalent, new metal sort of fan. So... I listened to 1,000 Gex by 100 Gex today and enjoyed it, so I can't talk about I've, it anymore. I've heard good things about that. I've also heard a couple people be like... This is the Not death of music, true. yeah. <laughs> this is what music? This is the the two opinions that people have about that album seem to be either oh this is pretty good and this is the end of music as we know it. <laughs> it's the end of the songs as we know it. it I thought like, it was like fifty fifty pretty good and just like uh audio shit posting. I got a war banana. Oh, I got. I mean, too. actually, okay, from so what I'm, from what I know about it, like uh, with uh, 100 Gex, is it's like the problem is, like the and this gecko? is for good and for ill, that the line between their shit posting and the stuff that's actually pretty good, there really isn't a line. I would disagree with that, though, because there's definitely some songs on that album that are like, this is an actual song, and some that are, here's a bunch of random sound effects. Like... Okay, I need know. to listen to it myself to make my own judgment. They've got some songs that are, like, silly, but they're still actual songs. And then yeah, they've got, I'm, I'm, they've got like, ones that are just, like... Here's All right, like the there's fucking... a terminal over here with the ukulele. Isn't there one that just kind of has a ska part for some and reason? The, the missile thing. I will take the I ukulele if that's cool, or yeah, if you want it. I I'm the lowest on it, items, but. but... Um, but like, I, I fucking well, died. Well, okay. Actually, but, um, actually, that's a good point. We should give it to Wim. But, yeah. but yeah, isn't there a, um, uh, a, what is it called? A, um, there's a song that just has a random ska part. There's, a, there's many songs that have random various parts. A X parts. And yes. then there's uh, the one which is Stupid Horse. Stupid Horse is very fun. I like Stupid Horse. Which is about... Yeah, I've heard which that. Is it's about, like a, uh, like really... And it's stupid. about losing a bet on a horse race, and then you steal the horse and, like, punch the jockey of the winning... I, I don't... I don't know. It's... <laughs> Yeah, Hundred Gex songs like are not big on regular like, weekend nar for me. narrative consistency. Yeah, there's another shop down bar. Okay, down there. But I got um, a goat pep. anybody want to? Uh, I could use that Laba. actually. I moved twenty quick. Uh, okay, what? So, uh, so Jane, what were you going to say again? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't remember. What was it? What was I going earlier? To say? You were. We were talking about, and I just wanted you to say your piece on the, um, uh, Cypher. Oh, thing. yeah, the greatest then... forum thread of all time. Yes. Uh, so I, to my eternal shame, um, used to be a member of the Odd Future fan forum Odd Future mm. Talk. Mm -hmm. And there was a guy there, I don't remember his name, but he was a huge stoner. He was a regular on the board, and he pretty much talked about nothing but weed. Um, okay. And the one time he submitted this thread to our random board that was, my loud ass weed won't shut the fuck up. And then <laughs> the, the body of the first post was just like, I'm afraid it's going to wake up my parents. What do I do? <laughs> <laughs> and it was a very good thread. Somebody was like, point your remote at the weed and turn it down. <laughs> I'm scared of the teleporter. And parents. then just every every suggestion he would respond to in very large letters. It's loud though. <laughs> it was really good. 
Oh, no boy. teleporter yet, but I found another shop. Some, sometimes the internet isn't a mistake. Yeah. It's got a goat hoof, yeah. uh, a syringe, and a crowbar. I will come over there. But, um... Right. Like... It, 3D printer, nobody cares about those. It was another one, it was like, you need to bring a live band into your house and have the band play to cover up the sound of the weed. <laughs> I was about to say, it's just, just play, play instruments so your, your parents will think you have band practice. Yes. Uh. Oh, Trey found the teleporter. Oh, cool. It's tucked in the, right uh, here. In the... the opposite side of the map from where I was looking for it. You know how it goes. Got a radar scanner. Running through the six with Malin. But yeah, um... I'm uh... running through the... People don't call Chicago no. and numbers. Oh, hey, we have banners set up near the teleporter. Apparently, uh... What's... what's... Did Chicago's something glitch? What do seems you mean? seems to be having some issues, visually. Because they might call it that. Uh, Raleigh is the 919. Uh, Jane is the... I, I don't know. Hall. Can you guys Somebody cover me Somebody should text the stream. Oh, right, no! I never put the banner down! Oh, my God. Fuck. Everybody cover me for a second. Yeah, that's a, that's a, that's what they call human error section. Eric, why did it take you this long to That was, that was Edlin, not Eric. Edlin? Uh, oh, why boy. is there a big black thing up Wait, in front of... Wait, the, their screen names are extremely hard to read with that color. Oh, that I, background. I see it fine. I might be because I have flux running. It, well, yeah, that would do it. Why do you have flux running while you're playing a video game? Because I didn't think it through, okay. Also, uh, uh, real good how when you are in the menu, like in the pause menu, it also moves your character around when you use the joystick to uh, select where, options. Where's, uh, where's Edlin? In the chair. Early access. I'm only seeing sections No, post. actually, you're correct. That is Eric. I'm sorry. Oh. I had a massive brain so, fart. Fuck you, actually. <laughs> Okay, maybe try and get one more level so we can get a yeah. another banner set up, yeah, and then we'll. Be, <clears throat> I got double banners now, so. Actually, I had something I wanted to talk about, and I almost forgot about it. How is your cruise, Trey? Mine. Yeah. Pretty solid. I uh, went to a bunch of places in the Caribbean and did nothing for a week. Did you? Hmm. I have week. a question. Did you illegally torrent any music on your cruise? Uh, no. That would have made you we, a pirate of the Caribbean. We didn't have any. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna kick your ass. Into the Caribbean. <laughs> oh boy. That's there the, we go. That's the entire reason I wanted to talk about that, was so I could make that joke. Oh Although, if, you, if anything fun happened, like, do feel free to tell us. Uh, was pretty chill. My, uh, but, uh. My, dad, my dad unfortunately injured himself a little bit. Um, Oof. But as far as everything else went, we still had a good time. That's um, good. We, mm -hmm. I, I spent a lot of time at the uh, piano bar on the cruise because I enjoyed uh, spending time just listening to music there. Is that just like a bar where they've got a guy playing a piano? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Cool. Like, uh... Yeah, piano bars used to be more of a thing in general, but aren't as much anymore for, I guess, because pianos are expensive and hiring a piano player is also expensive. Piano? A pianist. Piano. Not called Definitely a... said piano. He said, they said piano Son of a player. Bitch. Did you die again? I oh, said pianist did. in the later. Oh, Although, no. if you mean when it I said piano. It sounded like piano to me. I'm sorry. The piano. The, when I said piano, <laughs> oh, no. it might have sounded like piano. Because of the fact that I have. Can't believe we fucking died again. I can. Life's like that sometimes. Fuck you. 
<laughs> I didn't mean it that oh way, I'm sorry. Oh my god. Damn. I blame the Huntress. Okay, you know, um, I blame uh, the relevant Lugos. to Cruz because White has... Tom. Can I suggest you get fucked? Hmm. Shredney, I'm gonna eat you. Please don't eat Shredney. I'm gonna do it, and no one can stop me. He'll get indigestion. Shredney, you know. eaten by... And then, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I... I keep getting frozen. It's not a good time. Uh, am I catching um, you with my wall? I'm sorry about that. Or is it uh, the other good. stuff that's doing it? Oh, it's this thing. I'll kill it. Yeah, it's the bug thingies. I got him. See, the problem with global warming is it's making the cold places hot and the hot places cold. So Trey keeps getting frozen. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Trey, what the fuck does that mean? I don't know. I guess. I'm gonna take it as a compliment? Question mark? <laughs> I don't even know. I just said it. Stop hitting on your co-hosts. I didn't say that Trey was... What? No! That's have... not what I meant. I so you now... claim that Trey isn't... I have now backed you into no, a rhetorical corner. Right. I have, I have, I have no feelings. The day is that mine. Trey is a perfectly fine-looking person, <laughs> although not personally my type. But, and I wouldn't think of him that way to begin with because he's my friend. Uh, and we like, have fun here. Not the kind of friend I have non-platonic feelings about. Also, I just realized I did not, uh, like, say. I'm gonna take this other weapon. Yeah, that's fine. Um, say what our actual docket is today. We're gonna do Risk of Rain for two hours, and then we're gonna switch to Dead Cells for the last hour of the stream. Okay. Because I beat Dead Cells last week, and I want to see what the hell all the new game plus stuff is about. Oh, oh man. shit. Hey, we, we got, got the new, new area. Whoa! Yeah, this is new. This is, this is Scorched Acres, y'all. This is very scenic. I thought you said Scorched Bakers for a moment. Scorched it's, Bakers. It's very, very it Scorched very Bakers deadly. is when you're a dragon and you smoke a ton of weed. Trendy, are you dragon. doing okay today? <laughs> uh, <laughs> probably not. Fucking not. <laughs> Yeehaw! I got Yeehaw! horses in the back. Uh, oh, this is not going well. Also, uh, no. yeah, here, let me... Try to guard you a little bit. I'm dead again. Okay, well. <laughs> but look, what is what is so wrong about a dragon smoking tons of weed? Let's I need so much weed. To wouldn't <laughs> adjust my positioning anyway, so. That's what the actor said to the bishop. I'm me. gonna mute. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Don't Digging up this me. fucking, like, thing people used to say in the 20s to make <laughs> bad sex jokes on my podcast. <laughs> Live stream. It's basically a podcast most of the time, let's be honest. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, hey, Shredney, are we committed to our, our thing that we talked about yesterday? Yes. That we should announce it? Yes. Yeah, so yes. Uh, at some point in the next few weeks, me and Shredney are going to be watching Speed Graffer. Which, oh, is a, which is a pretty bad, from what I remember, anime from 2005. And we're going there's, to make a podcast about it. There's a guy who takes pictures of things and they explode. That is that is the main character. And yeah. he and he and this, like, superpower endowing virgin person thing is going on? With, yeah. What's going on with her? Look. Uh, I don't remember. To, We're gonna they have, have to... to fight against a guy with blood powers who wants revenge on Japanese society, and he runs a fetish club. Yeah, and like also he his entire goal was to destroy the Japanese. Yeah, like I think, I think the main argument of Speed Grapher is that horny leads to socialism. <laughs> but I'm not a hundred percent on that. I don't know. It's not wrong. It, it sounds like 
what if Terror and Resonance was extremely stupid? You know. <laughs> but yeah, uh, first, well, that'll be the first two episodes, actually, because we're watching it in a two-door show. But, uh, yeah, true. first two episodes of Keyframes Forgotten is coming sometime yeah. in the um, next, like, We also have a bunch of other things potentially on the docket. Uh, how much am I allowed to spoil? Uh, you mean the, uh, for the, like, shows we picked out for that? Yeah, like, potential shows we're considering. Uh, you can, like, a couple of them if you want to give people an idea. Like, we're probably going to at some point do Key the Metal Idol. Yes. I thought and... that was going to be your first one. Uh, no. no, that was going to be, like, you know, way later because of how long it is. Oh, yeah, it's not it's... even, like... Because that was the as... first one I heard mentioned. It wasn't as long as... It's not as long as Speed Grapher, by any means. No, we were originally going to do it's a couple. It's first. essentially equivalent to a couple episodes, but... But yeah. I don't know anything about that show, so it might turn out to just be, like, mediocre. Whereas with Speed Grapher, we know it's at least fucking weird. Yeah, um, well, I know that Key... I've seen Key, and I know... No, 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 no. I, know, I, know, I know Key uh, is weird. I meant um, the other one that we were going to do for our first episode. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, Angel, Angel Beats, Beats yeah. is a whole thing. Oh, fuck. If you do Angel Beats, you have to have me on. Okay. okay. Well, we'll keep, yes. that, we'll keep that in mind. We'll keep that I, in mind. I have we, strong I, emotions, and I need to rewatch that. <laughs> probably won't hold up, but... Yeah, like, Angel Angel Beats is another one. Um, a, a few of my uh, proposals... God, I have some written down here. Like, ones that I just kind of had ideas for. Yeah, I have a Google Doc somewhere, but I don't have it in front of me. Uh, where did I put it? Do uh, Razafon, you cowards. That would be a fun Razafon, one. I've seen Razafon. Razafon's like 40-some episodes, though, isn't it? No, it's <laughs> only uh, 26. Oh, really? Okay. I was gonna say. It's not that long. It's yeah. just that, like, I have seen it twice, and I do have solid opinions. Okay, here we go. Uh, I was proposing, actually, uh, Pedro Pedro-san and Windy Tales, because, like, literally nobody talks about either of those. Ever. Yeah. Um. Never heard of either of them. So point right. being, uh, we will, we yeah. will do a wide variety. Gosh. Windy Tales is, like, a sad Iyashike that's also really cute, um, but has a really strange art style. And Pedo Pedo song sort of presaged the whole Monster Girls in school thing, but isn't like Whoa. a fan Okay, I'm dead. Oh no. Also, my my model was like bugging out on the ground, so that was fun. You can do it, Trey. I believe right. in you. Anyway, while I have some downtime, I want to send you guys something. Because I saw well, this extremely passive aggressive ad while I was walking home from 7 Eleven, and I want to know where I'm think going. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, there it is. Okay. What? What? Exactly. So, would either of you yes, like I to describe to the image? Alright. It's like. It's like, what? What are you trying to say, Diet Coke? But somebody what are needs you to saying? somebody needs to read the ad. Yeah, we because we right. because it says above Diet Coke. Because no, we aren't quote unquote there yet. All right, yeah, I got too loud. I got obliterated. <laughs> oh gosh, that's okay. It happens to the <laughs> at least you only died once. Ah, uh, let's see. Yeah, I died in mine, every place. But mine was the Wait. one that ended up being the but last I, one. I, I oh. unlocked Engineer. Oh, I died you know. three times that game, but I unlocked the Engineer, so... Worth it. I'm gonna be multi this game. Okay. Uh, I'll actually That's, be Huntress then, I, I, don't, I haven't been Huntress in a while. I don't time. understand this. What? I'm confused. What? Because no, yeah. we aren't there yet. <laughs> What? It's a, um, it's a can of Diet Coke, and above that it says, because no, we aren't there yet. First of all, 
that so, implies that implies that children who met, let's let's be real are probably the ones asking are we there yet are the ones that are are going to want to drink diet coke which no no <laughs> um the only person who i know of who prefers diet coke to regular Maybe coke it's supposed is to be millie parents? i i, I prefer know. diet coke to regular coke okay it's just no like, there are two people okay, it's just two. like i don't imagine many kids do yeah yeah but true. the broader but I'm saying she's the only person that i know of i think that she actually has since childhood preferred diet coke to regular coke but okay, like, which you... is strange if Diet you find Coke. any goat hooves, you give them to me. Yes. Diet Coke is a That's sin. That's the important thing. <sighs> okay. But normal I Coke energy. is a sin. Fuck I capitalism. Energy drinks. Honest. Well, it's. That's. Uh, okay. Like normal Coke can tastes the Coca -Cola bad. How about that? How bad. about that argument? How about we say that the Coca-Cola company is bad, but that and so is Coke. You know, cola is an enjoyable beverage. I don't like regular Coca-Cola. I like Diet Coke. I do. There's no ethical consumption under capitalism. That's true. Yeah, yeah but that doesn't. Air but air at the air same air. time, there's no ethical consumption under capitalism. Yeah, I realize that sentence it, on its own means definitely nothing. There's no there, ethical yeah, like, consumption yeah. of Coca-Cola. There's. Again, you just. You just. Yeah. What? We're all the fucking enemies. Right here. Jane? What? Uh, oh, what's you just, doing? like, got really quiet suddenly. Oh, that's weird. Am I okay now? You're good You're okay now. now. Okay. I think my, I think my, uh, oh, internet might have hicked up, hicked up, hicked up, hicked up for a little bit. Uh, okay. You guys Stream got, good? yeah, I think so. Actually, let me real quick check the, uh, Thing. Yeah, there's not. It's not throwing up any drop frame warnings or anything. So I'm pretty. Okay. I forgot. Wait I a second. Forgot. Okay. Open like chest so... damage. Okay, so uh, like, who should get the gasoline? Uh, Trey. Uh, oh right, for wait. the turrets. For the turrets. Where's okay, there there are a tiny handful of ones that I wrote right. down here. Which, you know, like, uh, I would be interested for, um, for the podcast? Yeah, like, okay. well, actually, there are a bunch that I would be excited for, but, like, ones that I Go came up mine. with, which are, like, you know, ones that I actually am pretty... What did you say? Uh, when? They were talking about something in the game. Okay. Yeah, game thing. But, uh, like, so, like, I'm... I, I'm like interested to see, for example, like, actually there, like there are some where, where I don't think they were like su super well known at the time to begin with, but then there are like other ones where it's like, no, nope. uh, no, I'm not so sure. I'm the slow one. I'm slow too. <laughs> I'm slower than you. <laughs> but yeah, like. Uh, but, uh, yeah, like, Speed Grapher, in retrospect, is, like, the perfect opening one, because, actually, that was weirdly popular for a while. I don't have any items yet, so if you guys oh, find Oh, sorry, Jane. Useful, that's but, okay. um, but I do think that exploring specifically, like, um, like, I thought, you know, what would be perfect just because of the fact that it is just such an odd show, and I just kind of... Right. Want to know what people thought about it at the time? Was Let's get um, lucky. the Soul Nothing. Taker? Uh, I've okay, actually heard the Soul Taker is pretty good. Oh, hey, monster! It game. is. Yeah, I mean, I haven't gotten wanna. that far cool. into it, but it's like it is really fun and bizarre and just oh, like, teleporter spotted. Yep. Like it is, it is Akuki Shinbo at his most shinbo and I, I i and it's a transforming hero show that is also goth as shit and i love it um all right we got a war banner we got an energy drink and a stun grenade and, and also so like the plot just is is it's not gibberish but it's like it should be really hard to follow on paper it's really hard to follow but you just kind of roll with it when you're watching. And also, the main character 
has an at his special attack, you know, how he finishes off, like, these assassins coming after him, is he crucifies them with beams of light that he shoots oh, from his mood. hands. Huh, mood. Jesus. <laughs> That's like a fucking attack from a character action game. I mean, it's a fucking, like, weird henshin hero show just like but, but like somebody who who read hellboy oh, too many times while on peyote uh, and then watched a bunch of common writers what when you should come get this uh nog drink oh, i'm common but um drink your red bull yeah i, I like those. very slowly so i will probably enjoy that whenever we get around to it oh, I oh yeah like and then there are, like, other ones where it's, like, just shows that dropped off the face of the earth completely, like, pretty much anything from the big, um, like, uh, post-Evangelion boom that just disappeared. Like Raxophon. I think Raxophon... You pronounced it Raxophon? I Why did. would you do that? Look, who cares? It's a made-up word. <laughs> but, uh... I, I think so I think I right think Ross Oh, but you actually... pronounce Wickross, right? Yeah. You pronounced Wick Sauce. Wick. Look, I just don't like that one because Wick Sauce sounds really unpleasant. Yeah, but it's like Roxifon liquefied candle does something. not sound Remember less pre pleasant than Ross. Uh, fucking hell! It used to be internet slang. Weak sauce. Oh, weak sauce. Yeah, we're good to go. Pull the plunger. Well, apparently it's time. Okay. Um. Trey did ask. Yeah, and then did it like right after you said it. Nope. That's because it's time. It's time to go. Okay, but like shows that just disappeared off the face of the earth are like Brigadoon, well, have... Figure no, Seven, and so. just like. I mean, I already mentioned that, like, Peta peta -san just, like, vanished off the face of the That's from, like, 2002 or three, though. Or something like that. But, like, when I'm talking about... that show, I straight up thought it was, like, from, like, the fucking 70s or something. No, it's... No, this is actually... That one's more recent. It's, like, a little earlier, I think, than Shredding, Asamanga Dayo. I, I don't want to make you feel old, but something that's 20 years old is not recent. Uh, that it's not 20 years old, it's only like... Almost 20 years old. 16 years old. I mean, compared to the collected works of Shakespeare. Uh, <laughs> That's a good point, oh, right? But In like... theological time! Oh... Well, you see, within the oh. lifespan of the universe. Oh, dear fucking lord. Um, but like... Oh god, there's, there's some on here that I put oh, on boy. here that are actually not that old, but now, but by now they're getting to be. I like, mean, there's shows you know, from even only a couple of years ago that nobody talks about anymore. I threw on Shonen Maid because, like, nobody, I did it. Like, I nobody it fucking fuck. talks about that show anymore. <laughs> and barely anyone did at the time, me. Stick some feathers in your cap. But at the same time, it's oh, like... yeah, double jump. Let's all get extra jumps. Wow. Like that, that show Jesus. just got completely... Sorry, I, I got really startled because there was a fucking extremely loud uh, window sound, and I need to take care of this because it's going to try to reboot the computer if I don't do it like right oh, now. Oh, jeez, great. There's fucking windows yelling at me to install updates, and the thing was, like, louder than God. Uh, uh, louder than God's revolver and twice as shiny? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that means. What is this? Running a version of Windows that is nearing the end of support. What? Aren't you running Windows 10? Yeah! That's a wild claim. Pending download and install. Okay, then fucking stop bugging me about it. Ugh. Can I activate the teleporter? Oh, uh, yeah, but yeah, we're good. But yeah, all I, I all I was yeah, but basically what I was saying is like Shonen Maid isn't that old and yet it has been completely How old is not that old? 
it's like less than it's less than a decade old. Mm. It's like from the 2010s, okay. like mid, early to mid 2010s. Anything from the new 10s is not that old. You get yeah. to like the mid 2000s, early 2000s. I think that that becomes old. A little older, like, yeah, like definitely. Old it's like if it is old enough to be in high school. Yeah. Then I guess you can say it's kind of old. But I'm yeah. saying, like... But, like, yeah, Shonen Maid is fairly recent. It was a really, actually, genuinely sweet show. And just, like... Is it about a boy who was a maid? Yes, but not as ridiculous as that sounds. It's a weird show, but not, like... It doesn't like, sound that ridiculous to us, you know? It's yeah. just... gender. Seems yeah, like true. <laughs> I mean, I yeah, it's 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 very it's actually genuinely endearing. It's basically a show about family, which Shredney, makes sense in context. You can't give me guff for pronouncing a made-up word wrong and then pronounce genuinely with a long eye. <laughs> I can still you dunk on you for compass. Well, there is one. Uh, there is one. Ex acceptable uh, pl place to do that, and that's if you're talking about Pony. Can you, I get it. <laughs> okay, so yeah, now there, there's there's crates that have like specific kinds of items. Yeah. Like there's a, did, one did for... Did Freddy just die? Did I dunk Damn on it. them so there's hard no, that they vanished? I'm right here. <laughs> I just picked up an item that might be new. I don't know. The it's just, has... but like Fucking you're, hell. You're shaming me for my accent, you jerk. Yes. <laughs> to be fair, you people jerk. shame Jane all the time. Yes. Because I Compass. because I pronounce things with a flat O, which is like a very compass. minor dialectical difference. Compass. It's a compass. You call it a compass. <laughs> Compass, yeah. Well, no, well, a compass well, is a fucking yeah. thing from like where the wild things are or something. <laughs> a compass, a wumpus, and a hungabungus. Comp, I, I, I can understand. Yeah, like compass is a fairly minor difference. Yeah. Um, I, I think I kind of alternate between the two depending upon how emphatic I'm being. But um, uh, no, that does not fly at all when you're talking about water. That what? Water. Water. W water? More woods? W A T E R. That's water. 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 That's water. Water. Or water. No, that's water. God. I'm in New England. That's Shredney, water. Shredney, you're water. talking like my fucking grandparents, and it's killing me. <laughs> water. I'm from. I'm, Get some water I'm, and some I'm soup for the dishwasher. I'm actually living in Philadelphia now, so. I know you so are. It's not even like just a regional thing. It is a very specific area thing, uh, and it's water. I'm gonna hey, water it. you in the next one. Water. It's, 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 it's clearly water. I got fucking, Water. like, when I used to work at Wegmans, because it was the most bougie oh, grocery Wegmans. store in existence, I got uh -huh. yelled at for pronouncing things wrong. By what? my manager more than once. He was like, no, you have to say this brand name this way, or else people will think that you don't know what you're talking about. Huh. It's Reese's, not Reese's. That, well, not what even, like, la, like, LaCroix is how everybody says it. Apparently La supposed to be Lacroix, and I got told I mean, about that La more La than La once. No one cares. It was like, no, you need to call it Lacroix. Like, okay. Nobody fucking cares. Also, the fact is, if I'm not, is it, is it even like, is it, is it even a brand from like anywhere that's actually French speaking? No, but it's. I think I think Lacroix is from California, but um. Lacroix. If it's from California, then it's Lacroix. But like. That there was like a whole fucking style guide for brands around the store that we had to know. Oh jeez. And I worked like, in the no, beverage like, department, like, like, so mine like, included Lacroix. Also, for the record, um, if, if I'm not mistaken, there are certain words like it, it, like Quebecois French does a lot of like weird shit. So there are actually words well, that are pronounced more no, like they're in English. By the way, me, like I believe I just did you. When, yeah, like, I believe I just, you. It's just that 
it's for one thing, it's fake French, so who cares? I know. For another or, thing, or like someone's last name. It's like, fake French and fake Canada. Yeah. Like for another thing, that wasn't the only one. Like I was supposed to pronounce Pellegrino as Pellegrino, which is I think it's just wrong. That's but, wrong. But That's, that no, was no, what the style guide said, so I had to do it's, it. It's Pellegrino. It's Italian. It's a no, long, actually, it a you're right. L. Yeah, I was supposed to roll the R, which I, like, physically can't do. Green so that was fun. Oh, dear. But, uh, like, Boston. also, you can't... Oh, it's that's a lot of big yeah, guys. that's Spanish. That's not even, like, continental Spanish. No, 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 no. I got it wrong. You're correct. I was supposed to roll the R. Because hearing you say it like that, like, brought memories Pellegrino. of my but fucking like, manager trying to teach me how to roll R's back to me. I can't, yeah, like, I can't do it. Like, my tongue is, like, too big or something. I don't know. I can't. Like, it's just... I'm not gonna shit, I'm not gonna shit. I can't really either. Not being able to drill. Yeah. Or should I say, drill? I can do je, which some people Great. can't do. Je. Je? Really? Some it's people a, it's can't a, do je? Yeah, it's, it's like a sound in Russian and some other Slavic languages. Je. Oh, oh, you mean the backward, like, je. Yeah, je. 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 It's, it's, also, yeah, in, the, the it's retroflex, also in French, I think. Retroflex ZH. Yeah. That's like the, the X with the line through it. I'm yeah. gonna retroflex on you. Oh yeah, like your tongue bends backwards when you do. It. Yeah. Yes. Ja. Ja. Yeah, exactly. Oh yeah, oh yeah, okay, cool. The Simpsons yeah. translation meme. I saw this yesterday. That's I also think... a sound in like Polish, except I don't... it's like the R Z is that same sound basically. To uh to put my two cents in That's... on that one. I don't speak French, but I think the Quebecoy one sounds a little bit better. Yay, hey, I got the glasses. Quebecois is a little much. Is Quebecois? It's Quebecois. No, Quebecois. Well, I don't know. Quebecois. How often do I say that out loud? Quebecois. I don't. But talk like, about there's there's weird stuff in Quebecois. Like, in for Canada example, the uh, the word uh, which in uh, regular French is fit, is which is an F E with a little um. Uh, like up arrow accent T E is pronounced something like fate because well, I mean, like, uh, like Quebec stuff like or that. French, like, fate. there's like what 200 years of separation between that and continental French, they're, they're gonna be different, yeah, like, especially in the country. Also, they roll the, their R's rather than guard in some areas. Or they say them like Americans, which is really weird. Like, you know, a name like in Paris, it'd be Ronchon. And in the countryside of either southern France or Quebec, it'd be good Ronchon. To, good to go on and then, man. Yeah, we can probably like, pop the teleporter unless we And then, like, some something. cities in uh, Quebec, oh, wait, it's died. like Ronchon. Which, oh. like... Sounds yeah. Long. I'm extremely good at this video game. It's oh, it's a good video game to be good at. Also, I'm about to die, so uh, I have yeah, to I use the restroom are. very quickly. I'll be back in a. Thank set. you for not waiting right. until I leave this time. Yeah. Well, there's four of us this time, so. Yeah. And I hate the Doom Strider. I'm also not fond of it. I. Trying to like recover a bit over here, but I don't know. Yeah, I can support uh, you from over here. Uh, shit. Oh, Trey, you can't support Trey. He did. All right. Trey's fucking well, dead. I'm also dead. So. Jane the dead. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Right. Well, we'll yeah, wait a little Strider bit. Sucks. <laughs> yeah. So, is the topaz brooch a new item? Probably. Relatively. Because I haven't seen it before now. It I've... gives you a barrier when you kill an enemy. That's interesting. Yeah. Um, I am going to also use the bathroom since we have a minute of downtime and there's two of you. I'll be right back. I'm going to try out the engineer for okay. once. It's going to go badly.
but I'm gonna do it. Kenji's fun. He's my main! As much as one can have a main in a video game. Sometimes you just enjoy playing as a certain character. I guess. Yup. Yup. Uh, Hello. 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 But Hello. yeah. The Moth Messiah. Yeah. yeah, actually, yeah, um... Yeah, section. I'm, I'm not aware of the Simpsons translation meme, but I... I am intrigued by this concept. I I've seen so the the gist of it from what I remember was that it was this video that was comparing the scene from the Quebeca version of uh, of one episode of The Simpsons to the the French one, and it turned out it turned out that they've got like completely different dubs of the, what's essentially the same like content and everything, but mm -hmm. one of them. One of them gives like the, so the Quebec version of it gives the uh, the characters a working class accent, whereas uh -huh. the the French one just has everybody in the generic you know French uh, standard, French yeah, yeah, French standard. Um, and it turns out that like they they hate each other's dubs, like uh, Quebec and. Uh, and France can't stand hearing the uh, versions of The Simpsons from, like, each other's sides because it just sounds oh. wrong to them. Oh, man. Yeah, the French... The French get real snobby about French. Like... Quebecois are snobby about... Everything. I mean, the, the Quebecois are, are snobby about it, but it's like, in a way, it's because... It's a reaction to the fact that, like, it's kind of like, you know, preserving your linguistic culture when you're surrounded by people who speak English and don't really give a shit about the fact that you've spoken French for, like, you know, 400 years. Oh, yeah, exactly. Yes, exactly. Uh, at, uh, yeah, at, at high, high respects. The best Quebec French thing is how they just use Catholic religious words as swear words. Like, tabernacle. That literally means tabernacle. And they just use it like fuck. Uh, goodness. We're uh, getting everything figured out. Hello. What's, Hello. Uh, what's the haps? We're doing things. We're gonna play the video game again. All right. And I'm surely going to die again. Yeah, that sounds like a fun time. Yeah, Edlin would really enjoy this whole line of conversation. What are we talking but once about? Once I'm not being linguistics. Oh, hi, hard uh, specs. Yeah, you yeah. walked in while we were on a short break, but yeah, we are. Ready? <laughs> not here, no, this is... That's me. <laughs> I'm not here. Oh, oh yeah, no, no. that's me. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go. <laughs> yes. Uh. I'm Andrew. playing as NG for the first time. Oh. Uh, get things that do stuff to your attacks and put turrets I, everywhere. I know. Be that's fast. That's the fast NG strat. Fun yeah. NG. Yeah. Grenades. Huh. Yeah, but, uh, it's just like yeah, it was our, just a weird, what are we, a what weird are we coincidence. About? Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, we were just talking about. Well, as I said, we were talking about Quebecois French and like. Uh, what else? Uh, earlier we we had a long discussion about rap and anime, as usual. Those were two separate conversations, to be clear. Not at the same time. Although. Though, although. Although we could talk about fucking, um, that one manga I've been reading, which is about a high school girl who is really into hip-hop, but also extremely socially awkward. That sounds so, great. So, uh... 
blockchain. Uh, that's not nice if you win, but you're not wrong. <laughs> well, I'm not a high school girl anymore. Thankfully, <laughs> I didn't really like high school very much, but that's another conversation. I mean, who of us did? Um, but, yeah, that one's fun. There's also what there's a panel... What does the syringe do again? Uh, increases your attack speed. So, right, so I should take that. Yeah. Um, you should literally shoot speed into your arm. But, um... Well... There's a panel in that manga where 50 Cent is drawn as a span, which is very good. That's... That is actually really like great. not Like, not literally, but he's, like, in the background hovering behind a character, and it's, like, <laughs> evocative of that. Yeah, no, but still, that's that's some visual referencing there. Yeah. There's As... also a chapter where she finished... Where, like, she finished watching 8 Mile and wants to be a battle rapper. Oh my fucking which is god, really that's good. so good. That's so good. Oh. I wish I could remember the name of the manga, but it's just like, character name is here, which is not, like, yeah. usually descriptive. Yeah, Where it's... But that is, that is weirdly days. precious. That is actually adorable. Yes. Also, she puts her books in a trash bag. Okay, then. Yes, right. that's true. She does put her books in a trash bag. Yeah, you posted that. Yeah. Uh, which is, like, another thing that she thinks, like, for black Americans do, I guess. Which maybe it is? I don't know. I've just never really heard of that. Oh, that's oh, what that's... Eminem does in the movie. I don't remember that scene. I've actually seen 8 Mile. Um, yeah, yeah, no, that, she is talking about 8 Mile when she mentions that. Yeah, that's that's a good point, actually. I've actually seen panel. 8 Mile. Uh, I think that movie's okay. It is a film. It is it a exists. film. I think it's really funny that Eminem couldn't come up with a better name for, like, stand-in Eminem than Bunny Rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> like... <laughs> Get it? Because he's white. It's... It's... Stupid. Uh, the spaghetti song, yes. Yes, uh, Mom Spaghetti. Lose Yourself is a bad song, and I will not hear any arguments to the contrary. Jesus. I don't like Ouch. it. I, I, I feel Jane like... with her savage I feel like game. it's weird to have opinions on Lose Yourself, besides the fact that it's like... It exists. It I've exists. Never, I've, I've never found myself. The song enough that has the, it enough the to... song that has the spaghetti. Yes, it's the mom's spaghetti. Fredney, you cut Trey off. No, so Oh, I'm really sorry. I was explaining it to Haru. No, you're good. Uh, okay. Continue. But yeah, I can't recall like ever having an opinion on "Lose Yourself" aside from the fact that, you know, knowing it exists. I, I just don't care for it. It's one of those ones, like, whenever magazines make articles that are, like, 100 best hip-hop songs ever, it always ends up in, like, the top five, even though it's not very good. Because it's by Eminem, and it's, like, the one Eminem song that everybody knows. Like, everybody knows. That's not about, yeah. like, killing and eating somebody. <laughs> 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 it's the spaghetti song, yes. Mom's Spaghetti yeah. is, like, the only good part of that song. <laughs> because it's fucking hilarious. What does Infusion do? Oh, that's the health one. Who wants Infusion? Uh, I'll take it. Mom's I'm spaghetti all the way down here. Mom's spaghetti. Mom's spaghetti. Mom's spaghetti. Mom's spaghetti. The version, my, 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 my mom's spaghetti. The version of Lose Yourself that replaces all of the end rhymes with Mom's Spaghetti is arguably Mom's better spaghetti. than the actual song. That's... That is... Jane coming in with the nuclear hot takes. I don't... I, I, I don't like Eminem very much. I don't I don't think I've ever actually brought that up on the show, but I genuinely think that he's extremely overrated. Yeah, he's also, a, like, kind of a shitty dude. He's also, like, a huge jerk. Yeah. Um, yeah, although... But that's, like, I, not I, that rare for rappers from I, that era. I, I'm talking strictly mm -hmm. musically. Yeah, 
Although I do have to say that his response to uh, Machine Gun Kelly was richly deserved. I fucking hate Kill Shot, actually. I think Rap Devil was way better. Huh. Because That's a rare opinion. Well, like, the thing is, to get very inside baseball about it, the way that you Are we ready for the boss? Uh, sure, I am. Ready, yeah, Trey? Much as I'll ever be. Because okay. I can't <laughs> find any other items. And... But, um, like, to get inside baseball about it We've for a our second. resources. <laughs> to get okay. inside baseball for a second. Like, the way you're supposed to evaluate this tracks is, like, who, it's, like, makes the okay, better Trey, point. Okay, pull the switch. Okay. And the way people actually tend to do it nowadays is just, like, which rapper do they like better. I don't really like Machine Gun Kelly. I think his music is mostly very boring. But, uh, Rap Devil is full of mostly true things. Uh, Kill Shot, which is the Eminem song that he made in response, mm -hmm. yes. is mostly full of just Eminem lyrics. And I think that's an important distinction. This is a really weird boss. Yeah. But, um... But at like, the same time, it's, like, just... By this... By the same token, I don't know. What? I, like... I haven't listened to either one in a really long time, but... Oh. I mean, just, I haven't either. Like... Disc tracks tend to My not be great head. for casual listening. But, yeah, it's um, just... But, just, like... I just think that Machine Gun Kelly had the better... Chrono boobs. Like, on trees. Chrono boobs. Like, the better set of... Like, points Although, made, I guess. Doubles. Although, I will say that, you know... But I would... Like, part of the reason why I liked Kill Shot at all was that... It did actually get in some good digs. I don't really think it did, stuff. though. I don't know. Like, I have no opinion on any of this. Me neither. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> like I said, I know it's very inside. But it you basically... Know, I like I like a couple Eminem songs. I, the only thing I know about Machine Gun Kelly, aside the fact that, that he exists, is that he was in Bird Box for like five minutes. Was Machine Eminem Gun Kelly really in needs Bird to Box? learn to yeah. stop saying the Weird. F slur? Uh, yeah. Did he? Uh, Ma are you nice. sure? Wait, Machine Gun Kelly or Eminem? Eminem. Eminem. Oh, okay, yeah, no, Eminem has said that very recently, in fact, because he's an asshole, but... Yeah. I was just confused for a second, because I think, oh, I think yeah. Machine Gun Kelly's record, as far as that kind of thing, is mostly clear. Although I don't know a ton about the guy, so Yeah. But, um... He, uh -oh. He's just not... Hey, you know that glitch that happened to someone where they just could not move? Oh, good. Oh, fuck. Alright, well, I guess it's, it's you and me on this one, Gray. I this swear, and this time it's... Andy's cursed about that. Like, I've you're... only ever... I think I've only ever gotten it with him. Uh, wow. Weird. That's neat. But, um... But, like, I... Yeah. Then again, yeah. I'm not sure. Yeah, I guess it's just you and me for this one, Trey. Uh, that sucks. Yeah, a little bit. Um, oh, maybe if you can somehow get through, I'll respawn and be fine. Yeah, that's what I think the solution, for lack of a better term, is. But, um... Like, I would hope that, like, maybe the enemy moving me slightly would do something, but no. No. Ugh. Yeah, my death was slightly embarrassing. You're right, game. Little known fact that the spaghetti part was actually an homage to the neighbor's macaroni pit in Rapper's Delight. Okay. That's a true fact. That's a rap fact from... That's a, that's a hashtag rap fact from... From my respects. respects. But, uh, like, people don't know this, because why would anybody? But... There were, like, a lot of white rappers doing what Eminem was doing in the 90s. And to his credit, Eminem was one of the better ones, but I don't think that he was, like, 
markedly better than, say, Cage Kennels or R.A. the Rugged Man, I kind of feel mm. like Eminem's main thing that kind of put him over to being, like, famous was that he was friends with Dr. Dre. Yeah. And that helped, I, like, a lot, especially I, I for the just, second album. I will just say that, like... Like, in all fairness, though, with, regarding the Machine Gun Kelly thing, is that... Can we at least agree that just Machine Gun oh. Kelly is relentlessly mediocre? I don't like, like, best? any of his other music. So, sure. Yeah, like, at best, relentlessly mediocre, and Actually, at worst, that's not, painful. that's not entirely true. He had a pretty okay XXL cipher years ago. Yeah, but that's like... He was in the same class as Macklemore, I think, actually. Huh, and <laughs> Mac... Macklemore has had a career. He sure has. Uh... He collabed with a boy band a couple months ago. Macklemore is... Yeah! Yeah, that, that, that sounds like person. something Macklemore would do. Yeah. Yeah, like, my... Macklemore's an odd guy. Small knowledge of him. Macklemore is really weird because he was like the only rapper I ever had the like I liked him before he was famous thing happen with. Yeah. Because back when he was yeah. just like a fairly small artist in Seattle, he made some okay music. Yeah. I was I... never a huge fan or anything, but Yeah, but I've i yeah, I've heard a little bit of that stuff and it's good. Yeah. Um Yeah, it's just that like I heard mm. Thrift Shop about a month before it became actually, like, a popular song. <laughs> yeah. I thought it was pretty good. Yeah. I think Thrift Shop makes, is okay. Yeah, it Thrift Shop's laugh. fun. It's like, there's... Yeah, like, in terms of his bigger things, uh, I, you know, Thrift Shop and Downtown are enjoyable. Yeah. Um, thrift Shop is a song. Yeah, it, it exists. I yeah. think Maglemore's thing is he kind of caught inside his too. He got caught inside his own head too much. It's like, yeah. it, admittedly, I have not heard his most recent album, but it was described in a review I saw as an album-length Facebook post about white guilt, which is not a ringing endorsement. Yeah, like that. <laughs> that seems to. The problem is like that he. Ouch. He's like. He's maybe, he's maybe managed to be, like, I think that it's the weird thing of being, you know, there's a point where self-awareness starts to spin back into just being self-consciousness. Yeah. But That's he solved homophobia. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No, people I actually, get, I actually, I actually get, think that that song is. It's fine. not. A, it's just. It's not a bad song. Silly. People are like such dicks about that song. Like, I actually, it's fine. It's not my thing, but it's fine. Yeah, the heist God. is a. To to Eric's point, the heist is a like pretty okay rap album. There's the like, Schoolboy Q verse on that album. Speaking I of people who made who... mediocre albums this year. Yeah, I, I heard. Um, I have what, not... What, I don't... What, Trey? I enjoyed the heist when it was around. I think that I think that I'm in the same boat as section where it didn't really stick with me, but I did like it at the time. Yeah, that, that's, that's right fair. Uh, Alright. Um, uh, so what I was going to say is, like, Schoolboy Q is one of those rappers who I'm just kind of aware exists. Uh, he's got some really good albums, um, which I am struggling to remember the name of right now because are there broken. are there any that I would do you think I would be into? Uh, because I I, I, I have you're... no idea how you feel about like that whole new West Coast thing that Kendrick um, Lamar kind of spearheaded. I, I have no, I, I I I find it enjoyable. Uh, you'd probably like his first two, then, and maybe oh, also the okay. Oxymoron. Like, it's not yeah, something we can... that I go out of my way to seek out, but it's something that I don't... I, I find enjoyable when I do hear it. Uh, we can pull this whenever you're ready, then, Trey. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Oh. 
banner time. Like, actually, <laughs> honestly, kind of liking Stop. Macklemore banner among time. people <laughs> who actually, like, are just, you know, actually chill about these things, I think is not especially controversial. It's more like that he just, he's fallen off. Yes. That is, is the general consensus. That is how I would also put it. It's like, he started out strong. Not the same guy that... pop rap album, yeah. and then... It's like, not the same dude that was rapping over Axel F in 2007. Yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> but, um... Uh, I think he became a symbol because he was there, you know? Yeah. I mean, to the guy, like, to the credit of the people that criticized the guy, like, the claims you about You can take him... all three of those if you want them, Jane. All right. Um, like I'm the... swimming in items. Okay. I don't need to be. <laughs> uh, like, the claims about him, like, having, like, a white savior complex, I don't think there's those are entirely unfounded. Because there is stuff he did, like, especially right after the heist came out. Like, the thing where he fucking won a Grammy and then texted Kendrick Lamar to apologize for winning the Grammy was I think that I would stupid. Almost, like, I that's to, dumb. No, like, honestly, no, I think with that, that seems more like somebody who's kind of, like awkward and insecure and is not ready for that shit. No, no, like, I don't think it was, like, a bad idea on a personal uh, level. Yeah, exactly. But, like... I'm still I fucking stuck. You still can't I move. Caught the sick. You're stuck Me now, neither. too? What the fuck? Trey stuck. Yeah, now Trey it's even stuck. worse. At least last time I could move the camera. This time I can't even do that. Uh, it is, uh, you know, se I can't is right. Menu. It is... Section is right. It is kind of fucked up that Kendrick got wow. a Pulitzer before I'm he getting got a Grammy. Buddy. Yeah, the Grammys are... The, the Grammys are fucking uh, stupid. We, we need Dead this from already. one trauma to the face. Yeah, we don't, we don't need... We don't even need to be... Like, we just know. Yeah. They hey, know, Jane, they know, they know. Can you just end the that. game? Because I can't even quit. Wow, that's a lot. Okay. <laughs> the menu will not open. Yeah, I mean, I'm probably going to die here anyway, so... Um... We'll do one more run, and then I'm gonna switch over to Dead Cells because that's cool. Oh, everybody. wait. Maybe? Oh, you guys aren't in the uh, okay. lobby anymore. Yeah, no, we aren't. I guess that's how so, that happens. Like, it. I don't know. You, you end up in, like, a quantum state between being connected and not connected. <laughs> Wit is now a dot hack character. Oh. I actually tried watching that again recently, too, and wow, that show just doesn't do anything for me anymore. Uh, the world. All one thing that I know about Dot Hack Design is that it is well known for the Yuki Kajura soundtrack. It's a really good soundtrack. And, yeah. And on top of that, there is actually you can turn off all of the sound effects and uh, what is it called? Like a uh, dialogue in the show in the DVD options, and just use it as a mu long music video. That's interesting. But, um, because they knew that that was the appeal of the show was like the this aesthetic is Risk and of the Rain soundtrack. Treadney or Haru? How did I make that mistake? Y um, you good? You good, Jane? No, I think my brain's kind of frazzled today. But okay, I'm. It's raining today. I time. I've watched like three quarters of Witchblade over the past three days, so that'll do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you fucking. Oh, God. I, I offhandedly mentioned Witchblade in a voice chat, and yeah, and I was like the entire fucking. I was thing. like, oh, I should like watch the first episode of that to see if it's like funny bad. Actually, no, the show's just like decent. <laughs> and apparently, <laughs> like potato range. chips and or crap. Huh? The main character is a milf demon. I don't know. Gee, I wonder. Why I would watch something where the main <laughs> character is that it's a fucking mystery. Total fucking mystery. Hello, UVC Rocket Runner. Hey, uh, Andrew. Honestly, I don't know if I'd recommend Witchblade to many people. Like, it's. I would 
describe it as surprisingly good, but still not, like, great or anything, like... You're not gonna know. be seeing it win any Emmys. Do you, yeah, do you like Battle sure. Batman shows, I don't think, kid? I don't think I'm ever gonna see an anime win an Emmy, but... Yeah, you that know. would be that would be pretty weird if an anime won an Emmy, but you know. Uh, I mean, yeah, Stranger well. Things have happened. No, Stranger Things is a lie. Stranger Things hasn't show. won an Emmy. Has it? <laughs> God, I don't know. With all, with all the hype, of the, I'd be surprised if it had. We're we're we we have fun here. Oh wait, I got yeah. Emmys and I got Emmys and Grammys confused again. I got, I got broads in Atlanta. I, I I got horses in the back. Whoever I got a crowbar. Who wants the crowbar? I'll take that actually. I don't have any items yet. Crowbar are a pretty good band, by but the way. I don't remember what the crowbar even. Oh right, it gives crits. Crow. No, you deal Lashes. more damage to enemies with crow. Crow. Yeah, I was. Yeah, I was trying to do that. I mean... T3K. I mean, to be fair... Well, okay, you know, you have to qualify that, uh, UBC. You have to qualify that as not Wasn't a Whisker Studio Ghibli platformer. movie. Yeah, this is the this is the sequel to the platformer. ROR1 is weird. Yeah. I'm not sure... I'm not sure if I enjoy it. Like, I, it it's, looks it's a good, nice. It's a good game... I can't play it for more than like an hour. Yeah, it's a like I think it's a solid game. It's got some issues. I'm f I can't play this game for less than an hour, so. Yeah. Yeah. I I love this game. It it's already really good and yeah. I've I've been like dumbfounded at how much I've enjoyed it because yeah, yeah. like give me this game I'm... is really good. I wish they would fix the multiplayer bugs so. though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hopefully someday Surprise soon. We still have this bug after the huge patch. Yeah. The joy, the joys of early access. Did you see that bug? Just P apparently you can't fuck. Play as Engie. We are persecuting all Engies today. If you play as Engie, fuck you. <laughs> well, fuck me too. <laughs> I like that one meme uh, yes. that's like, you I have take the me fungus, to dinner first, and it's a picture of fun of Angie with like 30 bustling funguses growing out of him. Yes, Andrew, the uh, multiplayer is much easier to uh, set up in this one than it is in the first one, because the, yeah. the, uh, it, this one just uses Steam as yeah, it it's just, like, it just as its Steam system. Games. The first one had, like, some weird thing where you had to essentially do, like, some sort of team viewer setup, or... Yeah, Hamachi, that was it. Yeah, uh, it was, like, a Yeah, weird because it didn't thing. have any actual... Oh. It was local um, and LAN. Just a moment, I will be back. Okay. And okay. Hamachi okay. is, like, a... But, yeah, setting it up was a big org. And... We're glad that we don't live in the Stone Age anymore. Yeah. Also, I think this is one Good. of the few shows we've ever done where we've had more viewers past the, like, one hour mark than we did at the start. Yeah. Usually it uh, goes the other way around. Not that I'm complaining. Thank you all for showing up. Rolling. But, uh, yeah, I the, uh... any items that are really good for my character yet. Oops. You were napping when we started. You know? That's valid. Naps are important. I literally only Nap have time. the crowbar. I don't know. Oh, I've been well, taking... You I've can been take taking that more kit. naps recently for some reason. I don't know why. But I didn't today, which is, you know, good for the sake of the show. Alright, we got a cube. A primordial cube. I, got I do not need two backup magazines. But you got them. Uh, I'll no, take I'm not taking the second one. Oh, okay, never mind. I got bumped into it, so I guess I don't get a choice. Well, have we found the deli? 
The, the telly. The telly? <laughs> What's on the telly? Uh, there's a, I'm not gonna take the infusion. Hell, the one. The telly? Put him, What's put on? Him to the... What's on telly? Some weirdos just talking over a video game? Yeah. <laughs> Goat hoof. Greatest all of all time, hoof. Goat hoof. Goat hoof. The Goat Kendrick hoof. Lamar hoof. <laughs> <laughs> At least. What fuck fuck many, fuck ass? M many would leave you to lead you to believe. I don't know who the greatest of all time is. I don't think Kendrick's <laughs> like a wild pick. I mean, he's still relatively early on in his career, but he's got three very very good albums, and I think that's yeah. like a pretty solid start. It's true. Even I the one really that people think to... is mediocre is my favorite. I don't understand people that don't like Damn. Right? I, I actually like it a lot more than Tip Tip Butterfly. I will get it. Or, I was talking to Trey, oh. but Trey can have Which one? Sticky uh... Bomb is good for the turrets. Ah, uh, yeah, true. Sticky. Where's the teleporter? Where's the telly? That... I don't know where the hell it went. Where the hell a porter? Where the hell a porter is the teleporter? Hella Porter Robinson. Also, best rapper ever is kind of hard to qualify because they do like. There's like different generations of, of rappers. That too, and also like. Um, Some genres of unsigned. Like different skill sets like somebody like Kanye West for example doesn't mostly write his own lyrics and like that sounds obvious but then you get into like you know uh, it's a known fact that Jay-Z has used ghostwriters at some point so like that c can he still be in the conversation and it's a whole like big argument that will never be solved certainly not by us for yokels uh, but it's a thing people talk about. Hello. Hello. Hi. He hello. Hi. Hello. Did you leave? Yeah. They said they were gone oh. for a second. Yeah. But um. Uh... Hey, where the fuck is the teleporter? I ate it. Also. God damn it, Jane! If I had to pick like a personal, we told you about this. Pick for like best rapper ever, I'd probably pick Lil Wayne. Fair. Oh. Fair. Kyung on the Yamaha. Yeah. I don't listen to enough rap to even have that conversation. So. I feel like your choice would be stick man. Put back here. I mean, Wayne has an incredible amount of raw talent, but he doesn't always use it well. Um, I don't know. Like, even the verses by him that people tend not to like, I usually think are at least pretty good. And I feel like if you're in the th going on fourth, actually, pretty soon, decade of your um, career, and you Excuse me. What? Our respects. The rapper in Lincoln Park is named Mike Shinoda. And he is a oh. national treasure. I like that. I found it. it was yeah, there it is. Back here. You can, uh, Good you can, Lord. you can turn it I on. I mean, I actually there. legitimately really like Mike Shinoda. I do too. I wasn't kidding. I actually <laughs> like uh, that you say to me. Fort Minor's one album mm -hmm. a lot too. But um, uh, I miss Chester. Yeah. R.I.P. Chester. Mm. But uh, what I was going to say about Lil Wayne is like, I feel like if you're four decades into your career almost, and you're still like eight out oh, of ten, eight out of ten of your verses are really good, I feel like that's eh, like, fair. I mean, Jane X absolutely has me that I'd say Stick Man or M1, so. Yes. <laughs> okay. I mean, the, pro the thing with Wayne is like that he... At his, at his worst, okay, to be fair, he's, you know, he's kind of like, I mean, setting aside the stuff where he's just too sleazy to be entirely funny, 
Uh, he generally is, even at his worst, pretty amusing. So, like... Yeah. Like, I can't I can't totally hate on him. It's like he leans into corny shit, and it goes so far that it's great. Like, the so thing... So I, I respect it. Huh. In that respect. Oh, I pulled off something really cool there. Anyway, um, like, the thing of... When I say that Wayne is would be my personal pick for the best rapper ever. I mean, like, specifically... The rapping itself. Yeah, the rapping. Because, yeah. like, yeah, he, okay. he, he writes all of his own... Well, he doesn't write, but he comes up with all of his own lyrics, and he doesn't really do anything else. Like, he's as far as I know, he's never produced. He doesn't even sequence his own albums. But he is really, really good at rapping. Mm. Yeah. Sells. And I think... Fuel Cell's absolutely not something multi-needs. I will take one, I'll though. take one anyway. But, um... And I think in that respect, he's actually surprisingly similar to a lot of, like, New York rappers who, hmm. um... You know, are sort of thought of in the same oh, way, like... There's a teddy bear. Sean Price yeah. and people like that. Hmm. Although I don't know how familiar anybody is here with folks like them, but... I'm not super familiar with Sean Price. Yeah, or I've his, heard uh, the name. His uh, I don't former know fellow member of a uh, Pelta Skelta Rock, Rock rather. <clears throat> also, Rock Ness Monster is like one of the best rap names ever. Okay, yeah, that's mm -hmm. pretty fucking good. <laughs> I wish he wasn't super Origin. homophobic, but that's a conversation for another time. Origin mm. of what, Trent? That's the subtitle that they used for it here. This uh, this map. Uh, Origin of Tar. Where are Sounds the like a black from? metal album. Yeah, kind of. Oh my. Yeah, I, I can hear the tremolo riffs already. <laughs> Actually, yeah. if anybody wants a really good Lil Wayne verse that came out just like a month or two ago... Uh, he has a feature on Big Crit's new album that is really good. Hmm. Which is, that song is basically just like a knockoff of I Love It by Kanye West and Lil Pump, but it's much oh better my. than that song, so that's fine. Oh my. <laughs> See, I hear that title and I think of a completely different song than the one you're talking about. You mean the Icona Pop one with Charlie XCX? I think so. The one where Got this feeling the, on the uh, summer day when you were bridge. gone. Yeah, da, da, I love it. I like that song. Yeah, I like that song. That's a great like, song. I don't like the Kanye West it. song of the same name, but I do. Crush like, my car into a bridge. I don't care. I love, I love it. it. <laughs> that song is actually about um. That goat hoof is for you. Going out with oh, an older guy who. Oh, know, there it is. You ultimately get your fed up with for being an asshole. Yeah. Hmm. Like, you know, the whole line, you you know, you're from the 70s, but I'm a 90s bitch. Uh -huh. And then, you know, like, and then it All steers right. into, you know, that, the chorus, you know, I don't care. You know, like, it's Trendy, you great. put way more, like, roughage on that. Than yeah, the I know. Uh, song does. That was, that, that, that <laughs> there was, is just, that there was, is like, the heavy metal the cover. Vocal. No, there is distortion. There's a the little vocal. bit, yeah. And also a certain amount of vocal roughness, and because there's like there's what background like? any chanting in it, is. which is shouting, is the thing. Berserker's pauldron gain a frenzy after killing three enemies in quick succession. I don't like it because I hate fun. <laughs> no fun was uh some nights. Yeah. Yes. And also, uh, and also, all the... I really like that song. I knew about. You know, I had I had a friend who was a big fan of Fun's work, but way before they got famous. Yeah. Yeah, like I know, I know, like Eric. Basically, a Queen we're tribute you. band. Uh. Is it? Happiest of friends who do stuff together. No. 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 Imagination. But, um... 
It, correct me if I'm wrong here, isn't the guy C -A -M -P -F -I -R -E. from Fun... I'm gonna fucking kill you. Isn't the guy from Fun also the guy from The Bleachers? One of them is, yeah. Yeah, like, like one of the people from Fun also does The Bleachers. Uh-huh. There's another energy drink for... for when. I took one already, but... Thank you. There it, there it goes. There Although it goes. I... Although I think it's just bleachers because I know, of course it is. but I refuse to fucking. Okay, there are that. good. There are good <laughs> bands that are like that have names like that. No, but like listen, a, a lot. Listen, if your band name of... is a plural noun, I'm putting a the in front of it. <laughs> I don't that care. doesn't work. Don't do that. If you do that to swans, I will murder you. The swans. <laughs> Sorry. The swans. That's actually a different band. Well, they should have thought of that. No, actually, that other band uh, had to change their name to the Wild Swans when they realized, oh shit, there's a band called Swans, and people call them the Swans because... Because, because that's it how it be. should be. It is not how it should be, I disagree. I'm never gonna get over Rhapsody of Fire and Luca Torelli's Rhapsody. What's that? They're two metal bands. Uh, and Luca Torelli is a former member of the other band. Oh, oh that happens so sometimes. Like, after the front man died, Sublime became Sublime with Rome, which is the name of their new front man. Wait a second. Aren't Rhapsody of Fire like a power metal band? Yeah, and so is Luca Torelli's Rhapsody. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. I mean, that is a very power metal name. Um... Just like you guys no... remember Dragon Force? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Everybody was. Everybody remembers Dragon Force. And it's it. because of Guitar Hero. Uh huh. Many like. I actually, unironically, like through the fire and the flames. I'm really into power metal, and I like never listened to Dragon Force. They have a very good band name, is mostly why I brought them up. Yeah. Uh, it, it, it like... Imagine Dragon Force. Another sticky oh, bomb no. for you. That would massively improve Imagine Dragons, but actually make Dragon Force markedly worse. There's a metal <laughs> cover of Radioactive, and I feel like that's Imagine Dragon Force. Okay, yeah. fair enough. Another that's, a, that's a knife. Oh, there's I actually... It. What do you have? The uh, ceremony. Uh, uh, oh, you have the I ceremonial love... dagger. The ceremonial dagger is incredible. It's one of my favorite items in this game. Uh, it's also just as a probably really good on NG. Just to, as a response to uh, Altruzine Power Specs, you joke, but there's a band called A Band. The Band. There's also a, a band, band called The Band. I there know, but there's another band called, called the band called a band. P Diddy presents the band. Anybody want the crowdfunder? Holy shit! There's no. a band called a Swan. Well, actually, I can carry two equipment, and oh. I have no equipment, so maybe I should take it. I mean, why not, right? Maybe. That's I haven't heard of them, huh? Is it teleporter time, folks? Um, let me uh, pop open pop a couple of these. I'm gonna pop the chance thing one more time. And I will... I'll take these monsters get back to you after that. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Alright. But, yeah, there's... A Band, who, uh, and, um, A Band, uh, make, like, um, weird improv noise rock. God, I'm trying to think of some other bands with really basic names. Uh, Why do they are all, like, really obscure genres? Like a lot of them are, yeah. Well, a lot of early um, rock bands were just, like, the plural noun. The plural noun. The Sonic. The, the well, police. Actually, well, no, the, the Sonics were, were way later than what I'm thinking of. I'm thinking of, like, uh... Oh, yeah, like... like the crickets and stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah, but, um... Back in, like, the, the 50s. Uh, but, oh god, was it the Sonic? I believe... Or, like... 
one of those was actually like. You ready yet, Gene? We're on the edge of very hard. So we yeah, should yeah, we should we pump should, it. We should turn that on. Pump it up. Pump it. Pump it. Pump it. Um, actually, uh, we're act. It's funny that I mentioned a band and noise rock, is because actually I think it was the Sonics were like really influential like on noise rock. Also, uh, was it Downliners sect or one of those? Uh, whoa, that launched me really Sydney, far. You're asking a question that only Jesus. you would know the answer to. <laughs> I'm trying to jog my own memory. The only noise rock band I've ever listened to, to my knowledge, is Sonic Youth and only, like, a very small amount of their stuff. Uh, what album there's? Not albums, just, like, a couple songs because you'd probably I do, like Murray Street. I do a thing sometimes where I'm looking for things to sample on YouTube so I just that's fair type in words that sound like they would be in band names oh uh, but I and do I will say Sonic about like Son about Sonic Youth I think uh. you would like uh, Murray Street their album from 2002 perhaps I think you would I think you would l actually genuinely like it. Oh, it does shit. get oh, a fuck. little weird. Ah. When are you okay? Uh, I'm dead. Um, that was me making video game noises. I was about to oh. say, that was a frantic gamer moment. <laughs> yeah, this isn't going so hot. Okay, gamer. <laughs> Alright, Trey. I need to hide next to one of your turrets to get health. If you can make it over here. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Alrighty. Get under my bubble. <laughs> <laughs> under um, my thumb. We got this. We got this. The yeah, shield's gone, the shield's it. gone, the shield's gone. I gotta recharge. Almost got it. Right. <laughs> Back now. Okay. I feel Austin. like, I feel like everybody in this show, once a show, like, at least at one point, has to say something at least mildly suggestive. Oh, uh, so since Jane's fucking dead, who should take the second stealth kit? Uh... Mine. <laughs> okay. Man, and and you're going to submit there, an entry, Shredney? Good lord. What? what? I was asking what Shredney was going to say. Oh. No, I'm saying that, you know, what I said was that... Oh, thank God. You know, everyone on an episode of this show, at some point or another, says something at least mildly suggestive. It's yeah. Like, mildly. And I was going to say, so you're... I said, so you're going to submit an entry, Shredney? Oh! Uh... What? No, that was an invitation for you to say something. So, but... But you use the word submit and entry. I'm gonna Fuck fucking you. kill you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Come through your oh, screen. You just played yourself by playing into my hand. Well, come through your screen like come. the chick from the ring. <laughs> no, no, no win. That's too easy. You're too easy. God damn it. I'm gonna fight both of you. As opposed to what, being hard? No! <laughs> there will be well, you blood. can be easy and hard. There goes all our viewers. <laughs> uh... Fuck you, Buffalo. Both the animal and the city. <laughs> hey, did you know that Buffalo, 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 Buffalo? Yes, I'm aware of that, Jane. That's good. Who doesn't fucking know? Listen. About the buffalo, 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 buffalo. Buffalo, oh. buffalo, buffalo. Oh, the teleporter's right there. So it is. That's not what I meant to ping. God, I really wish I could find lunar coins. Yeah, they just seem to have vanished. Like, we haven't gotten any th th this this session at all. Like, I've seen, like, two capsules. Yeah. Use them on, but Maybe I haven't they... found... Maybe they made them way rarer. 
I hope not. I'm never fucking unlocking that character. Yeah. Have you seen any chests? Uh, well, if I look, if fight. I look down, I can see mine. Hey. That game. joke will be funnier once I've started HRT. Well, I mean, you still have a chest. I know, but regardless, like, mm. it's, it's the idea. Ha ha. Thank you, Shredney. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Gonna run away from this buffalo. Item! Uh, what is this? It's the Brilliant Behemoth. Never All my attacks one. explode. Okay, well that's pretty good. Actually, I think I've gotten this one before. And yeah, it is really good, especially on multi. With the, uh, if you use the rapid fire gun. It's ridiculous. Yeah. God, these buffalo have so much fucking health. Buffalo, buffalo, buffalo. Uh, so... You guys want to take audience questions? I'm just kidding, we've literally never done that. Also, there usually aren't enough I mean, people here. When although, they ask questions, we answer them. Although, if somebody in the audience has a question, do feel free to ask. Yeah, We will answer it. it to the best of our ability. Shredney, are you eating chips? Graham crackers. Those are just, like, sweet chips, when you really think about it. Well, you know, Ruffles have ridges. Ruffles have ridges. No. For her pleasure. Die? <laughs> I mean, but generally things that are rich for I will, one's pleasure do I not will, go in one's mouth. I will end your life. We're all already dead. How do I feel about Article 70 of the Constitution of Bangladesh? Somebody look that up. Um, that would make my tablet have a hissy fit, unfortunately. Or it wouldn't make my tablet have a hissy fit, but Discord would get mad at me. I'm dying, yeah. Squirtle. Mm. Get in my bubble. Under my oh. thumb. I decided to oh, just run away like a coward, but... Ooh, more equipment. Well, under Trey's no, bubble is usually safer than running away. You're right, but I'm a stupid coward. Running at speed. I'm a coward, high. but I'm a green. Somebody go get Lexi. I just referenced Looney Tunes. Oh, dear. You put up the Lexi signal. Do you know that that song has a, has a name? It's called The Merry Go Round Broke Down. Yeah. Also, it was sampled in the Crookers and Crookers remix of Day and Night by Kid Cudi. Nice. Day and night. Uh, if anybody the needs a rose loner buckler, seems there's to one free his mind at night. At, at, at night. Day and night. I think like... I've only heard a remix of that. The one that goes like... Yeah. Yeah, that one. <laughs> the long version of that, there's a bit, like, towards the end, where the bah, bah, bah just randomly plays the merry-go-round broke down. It's, like, one of the weirdest and most 2000s things I've ever heard in a piece of Are music. we ready, or... Uh, I'm always... Stuff to find. I'm always ready, so... Whenever you I'm see ready. we're good. I'm ready. I'm ready. I was thinking the same thing, Trey. How would you do that? <laughs> God damn it. How many Spongebob references can we get into one episode? I've never seen Spongebob. Those are illegal on my show. <laughs> you this say a... uh, Homestuck is illegal on your show too, Jane. Your arguments are invalid. Homestuck is illegal everywhere other than specific this is, Homestuck. This is, an anarchist, this is an anarchist state. You know that. <laughs> That's because Wynn is here. Wait, isn't that a contradiction? It's like you an anarchist yeah, zone. That, that... 
or something. It's, it's an autonomous anarchist zone. And also, I am also an anarchist. Just probably a different kind <laughs> I of mean, anarchist. So am I, so... That's what I, I said. I, I said this because we like you're, you're like, friendly. But you're like, you're you're more of an ANCOM. I'm yeah. more like... Gang, I love you, uh, but can we please not? I'm an anarchist <laughs> syndicalist, actually. No, not really. Uh, it's me playing too much Kaiser Reich. Can I turn this I on? Anarcho syndicalism yeah. is interesting. Actually, you know what's interesting? But... Turning on the teleporter. Turning on Communism. the teleporter. Communism. I'm gonna fight Make, you. Keeping things I'm... fun and sexy. Am I wrong? God I mean, damn it. no. Doom but... Strider 2. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh fuck. Thank you, Trey. That Round was extremely two. clutch. Uh. I might die anyway, though. Just to, like, flex. You know, just keep it fun and sexy. Yeah, we might. I'm dead. Like, not literally, but most likely. The music that just started playing sounds like it's from Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> Running around at the speed of sound. Got Sonic suggests a Hideo Kojima rainbow. game. Sonic syndicalism. Anarcho Sonicalism. Oh man. The Brigador people sell an evil Megacorp shirt, but not a shirt of the anarcho syndicalists. Well, can you fault their logic there? Man, I fail to understand why these things are so hard to kill. Well, it is funny because the Brigador devs are actually pretty leftist, but. <laughs> oh. Like, I, I get that you're a boss. That's fun. That's cool. At the same time, I'm offended. I don't, I don't like you, <laughs> Mister. This game Doom is basically Strider, the I dislike spe you. It's basically the Spec Ops the line of mecha video Rogue games. <laughs> huh? No, this is the Spec Ops the line of mecha video games. No, Brigador is not a roguelike. No, Trey uh... understandably thought that we were still talking about Risk of Rain. Yeah, Risk of Rain. Over here cussing about the Risk of Rain. Oh, Never no. call it that again. <laughs> Not unless I think did it first. Cussing and fussing. throwing your comrades under the bus. <laughs> Don't snitch. Fuck your Honda Civic and the horse outside. You know, maybe landing on top of the clay dude driver wasn't the best idea, but. Oh no. No, bad buffalo! Anyway, I have to use the bathroom again, so I'll be right back. You guys let me know bad if you Bad buffalo uh, is like the cowboy version win. of bad dragon. Oh no. I'm gonna kick your ass into the ocean. <laughs> I just said that for Jane and she left. God damn it. Fuck. I'm gonna have ass. to say it again Shit. now. Dick ass. Fuck. Wish I had better healing. I don't even know where the bosses are at this point. Oh. Fire, my business. <laughs> God, I wish I had armor-piercing ammo right now. I'm just remembering the end of the world. You know, like... Thousand missiles! But I'm lit out. Lit out. <laughs> okay, we will take a nap. And then thousand missiles! Really wish War Banners did healing. That'd be nice. I'd go to your turrets, but it's really fucking dangerous over there. Yeah. Oh, there I go. Uh, he's coming for me now. Uh, he's coming. <laughs> uh. I mean, he kind of already was, to be fair, but... 
No, but like for serious. Alrighty. Don't worry, buddy. I can wait. They're you won't the see me so coming. Bait. But, but I'm on. on. But I'm on. on. Sorry. The anarchist and the in Brigador are called right, the Corvids. One. Mm. So Where's that's like one? a like double combination of wind bait. Yeah, that's a very wind bait. There's the other game shredder. There's the other game shredder. I've returned. We're in hell. Oh? Oh, also, uh, Jane? No, yeah. Shredney, don't. What? Yes, I will. Shredney. What? Shredney. What? Now I need to know. What I've is actually it? gone too far from wind. What? All I had to say was that Bad Buffalo is the Western equivalent of Bad Dragon. Well, what he actually said before was, was it was for cowboys, but you know. <laughs> for cowboys, yes. <laughs> Bringing a whole new meaning to having horses in the back. Oh no! Da -da 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 -da. You actually outdid me! Luckily, I didn't hear it. Uh, Don't. Yeah, We're so got close. Off, but I could figure Trey, it out. No! no! F. We we're so oh close. Uh, All right. We get an F well, in the chat. <laughs> that, that'll be it for the Risk of Rain portion of the stream. Uh, we're uh, done with Risk of Rain. Ah, uh, God. Yes. Uh, now we are. I press F. I pressed F to pay, pay respects. Haru, it's not G. <laughs> Okay, Fuck. can we switch to uh, yeah. uh, the screen sharing thing? That'll be a little easier. Yeah, no, oh, we're, we're done with Risk of Rain, <laughs> so I'm going to turn on screen sharing for that. Yeah, else. done with Risk of Rain. Stop calling it that! I will end Risk. your career. Risk Ice Tea. Luckily for you, I don't have one. Luckily for me? Luckily, I don't know. You I'm know about what? to end this person's career. <laughs> I'm about to end this whole person. That's a murder win. <laughs> I'm pretty That's sure not you, allowed. I'm pretty sure when you cancel someone in real life, it's called murder. Uh, oh, I should turn on a... Uh, oh, it actually is already on. Cool. I still can't fucking believe that, like, for the first 20 minutes of the stream, I forgot to turn off... For that first like, 20 forgot... minutes, it actually was, honest to God, a podcast. Yeah, I forgot to turn off the uh, fucking hey banner. Alright, so, uh, what button was that again? Yeah, I can do this now. That's, that's, uh, that's the main Cast... thing that I've learned so far. Casting out to thine soul. But yeah, when, um, just to inform you, all that Jane said was, it brings a new meaning to horses in the back. And now yeah, we're going to go. Take the horse to the old Maybe I should also play Dead Cells. <laughs> what the hell is this? You guys seeing this? It's a big oh, that's cool. opening. You need Maybe. Rise of the Giant oh. DLC for this. I did not realize that there was paid DLC for this game. No, it's that's... not paid, though. Oh. I didn't think. Well, I'll look into it later. I, If it is, I will budget for it at some point in the future. One time. Whip it good. No, Haru Specs, H doesn't work because people do say that to mean that they're frustrated sometimes. By people, I mean me, Mala, and no other living humans. Wait, we do that for frustration? I thought we just did that when we had nothing else to say. You could do that for many different reasons, really. What does it stand it's, for? It's, it's like mean. the... It doesn't like stand the, for shit. It stands for age. It's like the gong at your local Mongolian uh, restaurant. You don't My need local to Mongolian it. restaurant. You don't need to ring it for any particular reason. You can just I ring it for the, hell, for the hell of it. Hey, I Trey, what? Okay. <laughs> Trey, I live in suburban Massachusetts. I don't have one of those. I live in Chicago, and I don't think I have one of those. There's an I... Ethiopian restaurant a couple blocks away. It's it's a good restaurant. They ha they they let you make stir fry and cook it for 
you, there's like a bar where you can uh, put together like a, a bowl, and then they'll put it on the on the big skillet thing, cook it for you, and then you can go and eat it and have as much as you want. But like Neat. Okay, style place, pretty good. Interesting. And, and there is a gong. You don't hey. need a reason to ring the gong. You can just ring the gong. Hey Haru, I'm going to murder you. What did Haru say? Hentai. Hentai. Oh. <laughs> That's all you need to say. Just with no further context. <laughs> I'm always talking truth. about hentai. Uh, speaking truth to power. Oh no. Put, put some respect on its name. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Put oh some God. respect among other fluids. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> We're all going to jail, but mostly me. <laughs> hey, I don't know what you got what you're talking about. I didn't do anything. <laughs> We're going to prison. Again? <laughs> to Twitch prison. Twitch prison. <laughs> well, does that mean that what, somebody You like... know what that means? It's time to move to Mixer. <laughs> ah, yes, the premium streaming service, Mixer. <laughs> I actually do act do dead ass like. I, I kind of prefer Mixer to Twitch in certain respects. Isn't Mixer okay, quest, more for a question. music? Or is that well, wrong? What what was it? Isn't Mixer more for like live music? No, Mixer no, is a gaming it's streaming it's site gaming. owned by Microsoft. Please let yeah, Ray another, finish. Yeah, another one. And it is indeed owned by Microsoft. Um, okay. I yeah, do, it's not music. I, if, I think that the like primary difference between the two, though, is that... Uh, Mixer has a mode where you can uh, you can watch uh, people's streams with basically zero latency. Yeah, there's save, zero latency and mm, their infrastructure. Like whatever's, yeah. Their infrastructure is actually like incredibly good. Yeah. Hmm. It's a pretty solid uh, game watching experience. Hmm. Well, that's cool, but. It says Trent. Says Trey, known uh, Xbox One owner. <laughs> um, mm. the Microsoft doesn't pay me shit. <laughs> yeah, the uh, the tragic thing though is that uh, like we can't do subscriptions and stuff on Mixer, or at least like not like we can't carry over. Yeah. So Twitch kind of mm -hmm. has us captive, unless Mixer somehow, like... Because of all that money we're making off the subs. Look, I get Twitch payouts like twice a year, and I'm always very happy when it happens. <laughs> Understandable. It's yeah. like, hell yeah, $200. Which money time. is a lot in, yeah. like, lump sum, but twice a year, not very much. Yeah. Uh, I think I get my next payout in November. If I've done my math right, but I kind of just let it come to me at this point. Hmm. Well, if it don't make dollars. That's what they say. That's what they say. Maybe if I type a lot, I can increase the amount you get. I don't know that that's how it works. So don't worry about it. It's... but... but Jane, it's all about the Benjamins, baby. They do measure, like, engagement and stuff, but I don't... I don't care. <laughs> engagement. How engaged are your viewers? Yeah, like, the number of... If people yeah. have... I'm a corporate executive, and all I care about is how many people are watching Jane's stream. Like, if people have stuff to say, they'll say it, you know? Uh-huh. Yeah. Wop your wallet on the camera. 
loads of money. Loads of Iman. Boy, I sure you love buying Fortnite. As recommended to me by advertising opportunities offered to me by Planet James TM's Twitch EP streams. Oh no. If they actually advertise Fortnite, Fortnite that's like the actual word. That's that, that makes it funny actually. If it, if, it is actually if my ads are actually for fucking Fortnite, then they really need to like Get a better, their situation. yeah, like a better understanding uh -huh. of what my audience actually likes. Oh man, yeah. Just advertises Toho. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. I mean, you can buy Toho on. Uh, you got a PUBG ad. That's almost worse. <laughs> uh, like you can buy Toho on Steam right now. They've got they're probably Toho ads somewhere in the world for something. Uh, a pub. A PUBG ad is is markedly worse. This Actually, no, it's not markedly worse. I, uh, I think PUBG Fortnite is worse. I think PUBG Fortnite. is the better game, but like, I mean, they're kind of playing in the same ballpark. So this stream is sponsored Fortnite is by... is worse because you know of the way the it exploits monetization of embodiment of scarlet devil really is it that much worse than fortnite i don't know no i said fortnite is the worst one because you it just... exploits monetization they, like changed, they changed they changed their no i actually i reversed myself i apologize i was like Nor are you still eating graham crackers north night yes. north side long beach Fredney, can i have a graham cracker I'm, I'm gonna. St I'm sticking it in the microphone. <laughs> Holly wants a cracker. Quack. Polly wants a kraken. Polly wants a kraken. The mind player is going to come into my my cage. What D and D is this, mean? Trey? I demand. Polly would prefer a saltine. What is this? <laughs> um, Polly is a remarkably disturbing song. Kill the enemies song nearby. <laughs> okay. You guys seen this golden orb thing? Yep. Do not question the orb. Just Told me to kill the enemies Never nearby first. Question the orb. Do not question the orb. Oh, it's making these man guys like a lot. I love Manhunter. Huh. Okay, I think. Oh, okay. Um, I don't really like shields though. So <laughs> maybe somebody got that joke. That sucks. I don't like shields in this game. I feel like they're not super useful most of the time. It, it, it hit adventure game Manhunter. What's what's Manhunter? It's an adventure game with the worms. I mainly giggled because I was vaguely confused. Because oh, for a okay. second there, I I thought you meant the other Manhunter, but I am aware of... You couldn't let them have Hunter. this, Shredney? You've ruined I'm it. I'm sorry. I, I was mainly thinking of the film Manhunter, which is Martian quite Man excellent, Hunter. but doesn't have much to do with orbs. Hannibal. Hannibal. Hmm. John Jones. Or is that a uh -oh. different... Oh yeah, it is. It it does. It does. It is. Uh, yeah, it is essentially. It's an adaptation of Red Dragon. Red Dragon. Yeah. <laughs> Man 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 Hunter. Hunter. I New knew York. I wasn't saying something that was completely nonsensical. <laughs> Manhunter New York is a 1988 adventure game. Cannibal hmm. Barres. <clears throat> That's a different cannibal. I yes, almost just knocked my it's... big gulp from 7-Eleven on the floor. That would have been tragic. And it's a post-apocalyptic game that has orbs. Hell yeah. 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven. Do All not right. question Next the Next run, somebody remind me to change my outfit, because I just spent the time unlocking that. Yeah, the alien- it's- A race- Earth has been enslaved by a race of aliens known as the orbs. Man, orb. early video games really just were throwing things at the wall to see the stuff, huh? I mean... There was a fucking sequel, and I forgot about that. Man, when you're, in, when you're inventing a medium, such things as genre conventions are irrelevant. 
scared out of that. <laughs> the rights to Manhunter are currently held by Activision. <laughs> oh no. There's an IP a just fate, begging for a reboot. A fate worse than death. <laughs> the series is currently considered abandoned, with no plans for resumption. Really? Mm, don't say. They're not gonna bring back a game that was on the Atari ST. Does anybody remember oh. when they tried to make it, a fucking, it, it um, us. like, Asteroids Space Sim game a few years oh, ago? Oh fuck, yeah, I do. Was that any Atari good? Trying, Atari trying to make a fucking comeback and everybody was laughing at them. Good times. I think they're still trying to do that. It's not working out. And people are still laughing at them. Like, there was Hello. a Kickstarter, but like... Mm. It, it, yeah. Nah. I, I, um, I think I'll be back in a second. Are, that I, I once again. I think a lot of people are just looking irritable. at. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh gosh. Uh, but yeah, I think that. I think they that were, everybody is just looking at the whole, uh, the whole thing with Atari and just going with that uh, Arrested Development photo. I don't want. This. <laughs> <laughs> that don't asteroid want this. game was supposed to be like Space Engineers. Yeah. Just same thing. Same thing with the whole Intellivision coming back. Like, no. Does anybody even like? Are there people that are nostalgic for the fucking Intellivision? Like, I, I guess. No. Like, I mean, it's statistically, I'm sure somebody is, but it'd be, it'd be like, hey, we're bringing the 3DO back. And that's like a that's well, well, the Intellivision was like a pre NES console, wasn't it? Yeah. Like, that's, that's going back pretty far. <clears throat> Not that such things can't have value, but I don't know if there's really much of a market for that. You know, there's, like, there, there's trying to capitalize on a brand, and then there's trying to capitalize on a brand 30 years after it was relevant. Yeah. Well, going on 40 for Intellivision, right? Yeah, somewhere in the 70s. Like, yeah, yeah, we're making the, uh, the ColecoVision 16 color mini. What's up? The new Intellivision thing is whack. Yeah, yeah like, the, con <laughs> the controllers have, like, touch screens on them, and then there's, like, a little that's, dial thing. That's... Well, the... it's, like, meant to, meant to be a modernized version of the original controller, yeah, but, Yeah, like, like, the dial uh... is on the original, but if you're gonna sell something like that, why would you try to... I don't, I don't know. Essentially, I, and I think that I remember seeing something about it, it like having Android as its like OS base or whatever. So it's yeah. just an emulator in a box, basically. Yeah. That's. <laughs> okay. Gosh, it's one of those things where it's the... like. Who rest is in this peace for? the Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> I really had high hopes for that thing when it was announced, and it did not deliver. The idea still has some weight, but at the same time, I kind of understand why nobody was really, like, yeah. getting, getting hooked on it after, after the execution came into play. I mean, like, there's those, like, uh, Chinese handheld consoles and stuff that are, like, it's just an Android operating system in, like, a vaguely Game Boy-ish shell, and yeah. you put whatever on there, and I think those are cool, but I don't know that there's a platform for, like, exclusives on stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. Especially considering that it's really easy just to get that same software to run on literally anything that has yeah. the same operating system. Yeah, like, you need to, you need to be in the market for that with console controls and also like your phone's not good enough so, for some reason. Hello. I think that I think that Nintendo Hello. managed to hit a pretty good spot with that where the Switch has like a very distinct use case from a phone even uh, though yeah. it exists within the same space. Yeah. Like they uh they're they're smart because they've essentially de delineated uh, their mobile offerings, which weren't a thing even like uh, at the at the outset of mobile gaming. Like yeah. they were, they were stalwarts 
at, for the whole we're, our our consoles are where you experience our games, which is still true. But at the same time, they they've got the mobile market as a way yeah. of sort of like introducing people to that. So like stuff like Pokemon Go is used as a basis for a newer fan the series to essentially be welcomed into it and then bond to something uh more advanced like let's go or uh the the new entry sword and shield like yeah there's actually a there's another pokemon mobile game coming out pretty soon which i'm actually looking forward to yeah it's yeah a, like like gotcha. a, yeah, it's a gotcha game and you pokemon like trainers yeah you get uh like a trainer and their associated signature pokemon which is interesting. Huh. I will probably check a that out. A Gundam Gacha game came out recently. Where in the Gacha you get like mech parts. That's interesting. Huh. It's like it's it's like you mix and match parts of different mobile suits together. It's like the like bigger console game Gundam Breaker hey. except the combat's way simpler. Yeah, okay. I'll take Haro says there is a Tochi. There is oh, a Toho wow. gotcha. Well, yeah, there's... um, that's not Cannonball is like a board game. Yeah, Cannonball right? is interesting. Um, it's it's a gotcha game, which is in like a board game format. And it's got huh. some like high class fucking voice actors. I think so, isn't huh. it also like I don't know if they, I don't know if they ended up doing this, but wasn't the original plan to have it like be just free full stop possibly i don't know and then but i, I do know that i, I saw know, all the that, but... people working on the voices yeah james got uh, that no. thanos blade sword thing no yeah. i uh, at least <laughs> this thing not is planned for release really cool which i hope it's gonna get it's like a die. it's like a weird double halberd thing yeah yeah it's one of my favorite weapon types in the game but, but um, what but, um, was I going to say? Yeah, so like I don't know. I am actually kind of interested to see where the Toho mobile game goes. I know, like, like I I am way less weary about. A Toho Mobage than I would be for most other franchises I like well, getting yeah. one because all of the money is still going back to Zun and uh -huh. like yeah you know I am pretty okay with that guy getting my money. Uh huh. Let the Toho man make his dollars. I try to throw money at Gundam or yeah. so that they keep. Bringing Gundam things to the U.S. Because, I mean, like, that, there, was that a, there was a drought for years where they just would not fucking bring over any games because one really bad PlayStation 3 game did really bad sales-wise because it was a really bad game, but they used that as an excuse to say, oh, the Western market's not interested. That's bullshit. <laughs> Yeah, and then eventually, eventually we got to a point where they were releasing Hong Kong English versions, and since the PlayStation 4 is um, doesn't have any region locking, people would import the English for Hong Kong versions. Yes, of okay, but when, games. Huh. have you considered that Dutch bullshit? Dutch <laughs> bullshit. Uh, yeah. But, and then, like, in the last few years, they started bringing out games here again. I mean, I just thought it was perfectly comprehensible. And then yeah. another... The one other most recent one that came out on PS4 was another bad game that sold badly. And I'm worried about them using that again. So. I mean, they did the same thing with, um... Like... Fucking Glitter Force, the like weird chop job dub of the One Freak mm -hmm. series, like didn't yeah. didn't do well, and like now 
the official line is like Americans don't care about free cure, so they won't export anything. It's basically just the same thing. Which sucks because like many Yeah, well people at least over here like Gundam anime like always makes it over. Yeah, at the well, very least. <clears throat> Yeah, we haven't had an official pre-cure localization other than Glitter Force since, like, 2003 or something ridiculous. Like, I'm pretty they sure dubbed, we have the new SD Gundam in English. They, uh, they dubbed the original the series, and then years later they did uh, Glitter Force, which is like a, like a reimagining whatever the fuck you want to call it. To it's the play. Robotech of Freak here. It's, it's like a fork and stuff, basically. Um, and that because didn't do I'm well. Sabon. Yeah, and that didn't do well, so now their whole thing is like, well, Americans don't want this, so we're not going to That's, it. That really is complete bullshit. Yeah. Or, yeah. as I said before, I will kill you, Shreddy. <laughs> I'm gonna go learn Japanese. Not really. Why do you feel oh, weird like about bike sports? The weird, like, crossover card game. Well, I don't think it's... Like, I think there's original stuff, too, but it, it's mostly not. Is there? I think I've so. never seen the original stuff. Maybe I've not. I've only ever seen... I thought there was. Stuff. But I might actually just be incorrect about that. That's entirely possible. Well, we haven't even remotely well, talked about buddy fight, Jane. <laughs> what is there to say? <laughs> <laughs> Small humans. You and I are now buddies. I like how you're still just going with that joke. I've seen so much more of the show. The, the, the show is too ridiculous to joke about. What do you even fucking say? Like, <laughs> small human, does he refer to? That there is, or, or like little human or something. It, there was a line in the first episode of that. It's a buddy human. fight well, is, no, buddy. buddy fight is Yu-Gi-Oh, but again. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh! 2.0. Uh, but what if more? What if more of that? Yeah. What if more than Yu-Gi-Oh? Also, it like... Yu-Gi-Oh! more than Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, everybody, all the characters have, like, companion monsters, because that's how the game works. And they're called okay. buddies. And that term is used constantly and completely straight-facedly. And it gets really funny when there's, like, a massive kaiju monster worm. Like... Oh no, his buddy's and loose. And they're just like, yeah, his buddy. His buddy, yeah. There's, there, there's, there's terrifying monsters showing up causing destruction in this show, and they're still referred to as buddies. One of them is called... What's what's that huge fucking thing that the twink fights over? The that robot. The fights over? The oh, robot the guy. gear god? Yeah, the fucking gear god. <laughs> Can I What's the something? one that the what fights over? The Twink. Yeah. His name is Grimoire. Yeah, I couldn't remember his name, so I just called him. I'm that. just confused as okay. That's the name twink. of the character. Grimoire. Can I admit something? What? What? I was never able to take Digimon seriously because literally every uh, every Digimon's name ends. In... Mom. Yeah. Yes. It, it, that's understandable. That's fair. Funny. It's funny to me. <laughs> I can't. I can't help it. Actually, Actually there's a fourteen-year-old that has like the voice of Piccolo. Literally, we think. No, I looked it up. It's not the same it's actor. Not, it's not the same voice actor as Piccolo. Really? But he's he doing sounds a, like Piccolo. He's doing a very good impression, man. But he's fourteen, and he sounds like he's forty years old. It's really funny. We're, oh, we're talking no. about the dub, by the way. This series. Oh, also, he had, like, loses to the I main think... character uh -huh. and drops out of school. Yeah. Oh. Because he gets beaten by the main character. He get he gets owned so hard that he drops out of school. That's just sad. That's like fucking Shakespearean. Also. Tragedy. Oh, and he's also like a criminal with an alter ego. 
Called Wolf. Called Wolf. Also, one of the other main characters. So he's a, so he's a furry. Yes. Also, one yes. of the other main characters. Furry. One of the other main characters is a kid who raps and has bananas for hair. Yeah, and you think it's just hair that looks like bananas, but then he fucking breaks one off and hands it to someone, and it's a banana. Does he Holy have shit! Or anything? This just happens. Holy shit, that's actually really good. Um, what's, what's really good is that originally happened at the same moment Jane was tabbed over when we were group watching it. Oh no. So we had to rewind to show Jane the banana. That's a power move. Uh, <laughs> it is yes. a fucking power move. <laughs> it's just, he pulls the banana out of his head. Um, but yeah. Like, just, so, so what I'm getting from this is that everyone calls each other buddies. No, 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 Only the monsters are buddies. The mother, the monsters are buddies. Okay. Every, no, everyone calls giant monsters buddies. Including oh. a giant worm. Yeah, yeah, the vor worm. The vor worm, okay. And there's a there's a twink, and also some guy who has a criminal alter ego go named Wolf. Yes, who is 14 and sounds like he's 40. Oh, and his buddy <laughs> is Cerberus. Yeah, his well, buddy Cerberus is a... one of the heads has like a scouter, <laughs> Dragon, Dragon Ball. Ball, and another one. Oh of the my heads fucking has like, god! Has like a Jordy LaForge visor. Also, like. The show's voice acting is surprisingly good for the most part, but then the Cerberus has really bad voice work, and I don't know what's going on there. Huh. How do you expect a Cerberus to talk like a human? Come on, Jane. Listen. I'm just saying I don't think it needs the fucking, like, 90s R&B auto-tune filter over his voice, or whatever the fuck that's supposed to be. Oh yeah, the whole point is that, like, so there's different worlds. Okay. And all the monsters are from like basically different dimensions. And yeah. The, okay. Wor the worlds are how it handles like colors in magic or whatever. That kind of makes sense. So there's like dragon world, night world, um. No, it's not. World. It's not night oh. world. It's katana world because. Wait, oh Art. fuck, I forgot. Yeah, right. Totally. There's a bunch of them. One of them's called Danger World, and I don't Magic know what the world. unifying threat is in that one. Danger World. Fucking Danger Which World. Which is what the bad guy uses, because oh, of course it is. One of the buddies is a dragon biplane. That. Oh, so, uh, hello, Hisone Tomasotan crossover. What? Oh, also. Oh my god, the fucking. The buddy that's basically that kid's dad. Banana Hair's buddy. Yeah. He's incredible. He's... He's... A... <laughs> you say it. I can't... What, what can I say, Jane? He's... He's a, he's the himbo demon. <laughs> oh my god, he is! You're right. <laughs> Explain what you mean by himbo demon. He's Absolutely the himbo not. demon. What is there to explain? <laughs> uh, I feel like Trey is making a disappointed face at all of us right now. <laughs> I am both even. Trey, are you still there? Trey! Oh no. Where are you at? Maybe he had to go for a second. Trey checked out. No sleep with not blame. Minecraft villager voice. Hmm. Huh. <laughs> oh, I forgot to change my outfit. Fuck. I I understand that feeling. No, I got a new outfit in the game. Not no, a I was just I was just saying. No, I I know I was paying attention. I'm just saying. 
I know that feeling. None of you are free from sin. Hello again, Trey. Hi, Hi. Kimbo Demon. Stop that! <laughs> <laughs> Look, I only say it about the Kimbo Demon because that's what he is. I need to see some screenshots of this. The character's show. actual name is Asmodai. If you want to Google Asmodai, comma buddy fight, you'll probably find him. Yeah, um, Asmodai is the name of a fairly notable demon in uh, Jewish folklore, and probably takes its name from uh, Ashma Deva who was a major demon in Persian mythology. Well, is he a himbo? <laughs> no. No, actually. <laughs> Sounds like but the buddy fight version is better to me. <laughs> it's a cool you guy to always, have fun you with. You can always improve a piece of media by including himbos. Always. <laughs> how, how, okay, just yeah, for just clarity, how fact. are we... Are we- how are we defining himbo here? Treadney. <laughs> Think about it. Is that- is that something that requires <laughs> defining? It's so- so just- <laughs> just man himbo? Yes, that's there's what a, it means. There's a un- Himbos are a universal truth. <laughs> okay. I'm not even male attracted, but I still say himbo rights. So like, so like, how how swole we talking? Uh, me, reasonably, me. like not okay. crazy because it's not JoJo, what, but one need not, <laughs> one need not be ridiculously cut, just a little cut, just slight, just a little, yeah, just a little jack, yeah, lightly jack, reasonably <laughs> swole. Reasonably swole. <laughs> Reasonably swole. Oh, uh, that would make that'll make a great episode title if I remember to actually make it. Better. Reasonably swole. <laughs> Reasonably swole. Reasonably swole. Not really excessively swole. Just reasonably swole within moderation. I would really like to get another weapon. I mean, you can, you know, always go down the shady alley and ask for Sal. Do you do you fancy yourself a himbologist, Jane? <laughs> no, I leave that for people who who need himbos in their life. Fair, fair. Himbology sounds like the good kind of Scientology. <laughs> There's no cult of himboism. That's what I'm saying. It's it's like it it's like something that people actually need in their lives and improves it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> why does Game's anybody dying. watch this show? Because <laughs> it's fun and enjoyable. Uh, because of just my my blazing charisma and your presence. My I'd presence. like some presents. I would also that, like a present. I'm basically always not. down for presents. Yeah, I'm same. Always down to clown. No, that's Mala. Ooh, where did my voice go okay, for a second? Okay, I've that got an weird. image. I'll, I'll load this in the chat. This is Asmodai, the demon himbo. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah. 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 yeah per okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. I haven't. I haven't heard a damn thing about this anime, and and yet, yeah, he's got that energy. <laughs> he does have that energy. He can break dance. Did you know that? He can, can he? He can break dance, and his partner can rap. So. Yeah. Well, okay. He raps. I wouldn't say he can. I wouldn't say he can rap. I'd say he raps. Yeah, you know. What boy Not are we talking raps. about? I phased out. <laughs> okay, so if somebody wants to drop that link in the chat real quick. What link? The, the picture of Asmodai. The picture of Asmodai. Oh, man. Uh, Thank you, Trey. This boy. Future card, buddy. 
fight for for all time. Not to be confused with card fight Vanguard. Fight Vanguard. Yeah. Which, Which is a different show owned by games. the same people, yeah. Well, this is about card games, too. No, I'm saying it's about card games as in it's, oh. like, initially set, at the very least, in, like, the relatively mundane world. And it's just uh -uh. about playing card games. Hey, I think um, looks cool might be, like, the best response I've ever seen to anybody I mean, give about somebody they were attracted to, maybe. <laughs> or not. It's just, like, a really funny thing to say about a person, honestly. Looks cool. <laughs> looks cool. Yeah. B. <laughs> I want to elect him president. I want to elect him Wig. president. Oh? Wig? What? Oh, oh, no. oh, fucking no! Swap. Oh, Groovy. oh, wig, oh. wig, wig. Uh, the last hour wig. of the show always just degenerates into nonsense. Wig, and I don't know if that's an argument that we should make the show shorter or longer. Please say psych. <laughs> longer. Please uh. say wig. Multiple Noxbow? Okay. Please say wig. I'll have you know I'm the smartest person in the room right now. I'm the only one in the room right now, which ergo makes me the smartest. Buzz no, in like the metaphorical room, that's hey, all for, that's all for Asma us. That's the probably all for us. Yeah. Who Did you just fucking say Bazinga? But well, no, Bazinga. I didn't. No, Trey. Bazinga. Trey said Bazinga. Bazinga. Gazanga. No. Zimbabwe. <laughs> Mozambique! Uh, Portuga. Uh, Asmodai. Asmodai is the name of the come on, pretty much. A-S-M-O-D-A-I. I'm picking up good vibrations. She's giving me excitations. Ba 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 ba. <sighs> let it be. Let it be. Let it be. Just let it be. Everybody good? Na na no. na 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 na. You're welcome, Eric. <laughs> na 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 na. na. Woo, woo. Hey, Are we really going all the way to midnight? Um, uh, the we've greatest, only got half an hour left. Oh, recently, I just okay, like oh, well, on. okay, well, recently-ish, I re-listened to the residents, the Third Reich and Roll, and it ends with um, the coda to Hey Jude, with the vocal, the background vocals from Sympathy for the Devil. Huh. Uh, na 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 na, woo woo, woo woo. It's so good. For anyone who's feeling concerned, Third Reich and Roll is an album by the by the Residents and is like a parody of Nazi propaganda. Is that? Uh, yeah. Right? It's basically Roughly? well, it's a parody of it's a parody of '60s pop music and. Well, like, thematically, like, I mean. Yeah, thematically, well, thematically, it's a joke about people thinking that Nazi propaganda is infiltrating everything. And a, of a satanic pan. I think it was a commentary also on, like, satanic panic and stuff like that. I see. And, and so, like, you know, like, heavy metal is, you know, turning the children to Satanism and then just claiming, oh, all 50s and 60s pop music was secretly being engineered by Nazi war criminals. Well, it's like making me think of the fact that they straight up made, like, German and Nazi versions of 60s pop songs for Wolfenstein. Oh yeah, they did do that. Uh, they, they actually, they sample a Chubby Check, uh, Chubby Checker's German version of the twist at the beginning of the Third Reich roll. And at other points, they actually have a, um, an operatic soprano singing Papa's Got a Brand New Bag in German. Hey, remember Bioshock Infinite? Yeah. No! 
<laughs> I mean, it did that too. No. It, except it was the twenties. And I mean, yeah, Col Colum Colombia is America, but it's like a white supremacist because America. Because the dude so. heard the music yeah. through time rifts, <laughs> and then, and then yeah. wrote it down and yeah. recorded it. <laughs> but also, what so, if racism? So and... weird game, like ideologically. What if I, well, I not I like it and more than I black people than... are bad? Yeah. Bioshock Infinite. What if the I... real criminals are the friends we made along the way? Wait. No. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. No, I fucked it up. Rewind. Uh. What if the what if no where did the original what if the real blank were the friends we made along the way come from i don't actually know it's been lost in time probably a nope. disney movie or something probably i think it's the, something like the, G. Re Joe. the real blank of friends we made along the way was the friends we made along the way well now we know and knowing is half the battle see also, sorry to bail, but I have to use the restroom real quick. I'll be right back. Do you two have to use the restroom, Fredney? I actually do, but Fredney, I can't wait. I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> okay. Trey is here too, so Fredney can. Go, I guess, I guess I'm, gonna I'm gonna fucking do it. I didn't announce my my departure when I did it. I just did it. Wow. That's because you're, you know, just like, just. Just you have that energy, you have that power. I guess that that yeah. flex, you know. I don't mean the flex, but. <laughs> <laughs> See you in a moment. Ooh. So Trey. Yes. How's it going? I'm okay. I'm holding my copy of Watch Dogs 2 for the Xbox One. What about you? How are you doing? I'm gay. Nice. 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 Uh, so Andrew mentioned in the chat, now you got me thinking of Rock and Roll, the 80s animated film about the rock star who tries to stu summon demons. My, uh, what, one of my friends in college was talking to, about that movie to me and how it essentially had, like, uh, a scene that was like more or less like not quite <laughs> it, it was more sexy than an animated film had any right to be <laughs> which you know I'm I'm like I, I was weirded out until I it, uh, until they showed it to me and I was like oh okay well that that is a thing that happened <laughs> our, our conversation also included uh Cool World, that uh, that terrible, that terrible movie from from the eighties that was like, what is Roger Rabbit? but sexy? Oh God, yeah, that movie. Is... Why is just hentai in the chat again? <laughs> just the word Be hentai. Because we're talking about sexy cartoons. No. <laughs> That's forbidden. Oh, no. God. Um. I can't remember when Cool World was specifically, but like, yeah, maybe it might have been '90s. I, either, either way, God, Cool World was bad. Not a good, not you a good might movie. Might be a '90s child if you remember. <laughs> uh, Hollywood. So the real friends were the hydration we absorbed along the way. Remember, yeah, stay Cool hydrated. World was back. Yeah, Ralph actually. Oh, uh, we didn't. Yeah. Uh, we actually we didn't get stay hydrated bot in the chat today. I wonder if it's. Uh, like, broken. you. It, I. Oh yeah. Oh no. For a second, a while ago, I thought it, but it was actually Altruazine doing that thing about like Fortnite. <laughs> well, you know what that means, folks. And it's ranting. not time. It's not time to drink water, but you know what it is time for. Drink your Red Bull. Game oh room. no! It gives you wings. It gives you wings. It, it gives, gives you wings. wings. Oh god! Oh no! Hey, apparently Red Bull and vodka is a thing. 
Yeah, yeah. I've heard of that. Yeah. My dad Just... does it sometimes. That's, oh, man. like, you know, I occasionally worry about being unhealthy because I do drink more soda than I probably should. Then I hear about that, and I'm like, actually, you know, maybe I'm fine. <laughs> like original, it's like original formulation for loco. Bad. <laughs> they or shall liquor. taste oblivion. Uh, which tastes like Red Bull, which is disgusting. <laughs> Red Bull disgusting. is probably not the worst energy drink. Tastes awful. I hate. But it. yeah, it's I not think... that great. You ever had highball? That stuff is like vomit in a can. It's just uh, I thank, thank God no. But Rockstar is also pretty bad. I like, highball is. I a, used to like Rockstar, but highball oh, is no. off-brand Rockstar. I don't drink that shit anymore. For a point of now, comparison. Also, the guy. Also, like the primary, the CEO, I think, of Rockstar Energy is an asshole. Well, Rockstar. You know, Rockstar is owned by by Coke. You're probably well, no, it's the guy, or, or no, 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 like the guy, you know, the guy who founded the company, which I, I think and it got bought so, out by Coke. And then sold get, it. Get Maybe so. Yeah. Yeah, he's like a big Trump supporter. Uh, hey, well, guillotine wouldn't be a bad name for an energy drink. Fuck, dum, right. Dum, dum, dum. <laughs> <laughs> It'll make you lose your head. <laughs> Lose your head, oh man. Uh, Props to John Bellion for for uh, forming the basis of that joke. Just thinking about his song, I... which goes bum ba dum bum bum. Even when I lose my head, guillotine. Oh man. He's also a uh, John Bellion song seems like that? one of those guys I just can't like. Just I can't cannot. dislike. I like I can't, you know, feel any active dislike towards him because he knows he he knows what he's doing. Yeah. You know what I'm doing? I don't know what I'm doing half the time. I like good pop music, which means that generally speaking, I like his output. Like All Time Low is a humorous song. Yeah. I mean, just like uh, about you know, just everything kind of sucks. Why? Why is there an excerpt from the Power Thirst videos in my chat right now? <laughs> <laughs> That's because the Power uh, Thirst videos are classic internet culture. You like chocolate? Well, what about chocolate? So oh, God. My. I my friend group babies, in high school. Lots and lots of babies. My friend group in high school would have like entire conversations that were just us <laughs> quoting those videos to each other. Because uh, even in the there. impossibly lame world of high school, I hung out with some extremely <laughs> lame people. <laughs> but I mean that's but that's like lame I can get behind. <laughs> yeah, all of those people are either some kind of queer now or they're Trump supporters. Well, uh -huh. <laughs> can't win them all. It's everyone in our generation. Yeah. Oh dear. Are you gay or a Trump supporter? The two genders. <laughs> Two genders are gay or Trump supporter. Uh, Long ago, the four nations lived together in harmony. <laughs> uh, but then the Republicans attack. Uh, we had fun here. Do we? You know. I mean, I'm having fun. I'm, a, I'm enjoying myself. I don't know about anybody else. Trey, we didn't need to know that. Trey, I'm going to put you in a box and ship you to China. Living in a cardboard box. And I'm living in a box. Well, Am I living in a cardboard box? I found my way. I wasn't sure. I wasn't bag. sure if you were gonna do it, so I had to do it. No, Trey, it's box. it's 
Actually, what is the Lear thing? Okay. I forget. It's something about finding your way out of the cell. Yeah, oh, well, it's like... I... Is it I need to find my way out of this cellophane bag? Point is, it's about a bag. Yeah, it's a... Uh... Bags, boxes... Do you ever... Do you ever feel like a plastic bag? No, that's a different song. Well, I got... I, I got am. my head checked by a jumbo jet. It wasn't what? easy. But nothing is. What's that from? <laughs> when I feel every metal... <laughs> In a visit I made all. In a gotta In a gotta Davida, baby. Oh, <laughs> nay. Don't you know that I love you? In a gotta Davida, baby. I like. Viva La Vida is a good song. Listen I sang it at a talent show once and made, hmm. it made people actually like me. That's good. Uh, You're very likable in general. Imagine so, being liked. Couldn't beat me. Is it so uh, I mean, I can imagine liked? it, but I don't know if I've experienced it. <laughs> uh, uh, we have depression sometimes. <laughs> on this show. That's not even wrong! That's it. That's the show. Uh, it's gay and we have depression. Thank you, good night. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Me softly with his song, killing me softly. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, you know. If I'm going to be killed softly by song, That's not what then it should be. Yeah. Well, no, you know who kills me softly? Wait, you're gonna, you're gonna be killed softly by song? The organization from Symphogear? Hey, when I'm gonna fucking. No. Congratulations for referencing old, a good like, show. With his no, I, I'm just saying, the, the last song to, like, kill me softly with its words was probably Bobby by Logic. Uh, <laughs> it's all, it's all by Rachel Keenan. Ten minutes were left. We almost made it without <laughs> Logic. No, I actually, almost did it. I actually referenced Logic obliquely really early. <laughs> and I feel the ghost of Marin in this Chili's tonight. <laughs> yes! I feel the ghost of Logic in this Chili's tonight. <laughs> Bobby Kennedy, the way I fuck with Marilyn. What I does that Kennedy mean? Like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I mean, other I than swear the fact I'm not that, that Robert guy. Kennedy is definitely... I brought a super stoker to a drive-by. <laughs> but I mean, I know... Okay, Robert That's Kennedy relatable. had an affair with Marilyn Monroe. No, but what does it mean? Like, what is Logic trying to claim that he does? Like, what's... What is... Uh, what is the joke well, relate to? Uh, he, he thinks is that he, he is, is a he from Maryland? Is he from Maryland? Maybe? He is. Yeah, okay, that would be it then, I guess. But Jesus, yeah, that's, that's a scratch. That's the joke then. <laughs> Maryland, Maryland. It's still really stupid. It's really fucking stupid. But that kind of sums up wife. like most Ooh. of that album. It's ironic that his name is Logic. I mean, that one, that line is from an older song of his. Like, I think it was a freestyle that he did on on a radio station once. Which is, that the has, same, is that the same here's one? Here's the real question. Is that the same one where he says he's not racist because he speaks Islam? Yeah. What? Yeah, <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's I, it. Just, like, I... Was Logic ever remotely good? Like, I don't know. People tell me that he was at one point. Like, at one I, point. At one point. Can I admit to something? What? Yeah, I know. No. Okay. I Are you going to admit that you originally of kind of liked him? Yeah, with that song included. I just don't understand it. What does it mean? <laughs> I thought um, it was funny when I was like 17, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, the real question, no, you have to you have to say it like Miley Cyrus. What does it mean? What does it mean? <laughs> oh god. Bloody daddy. We like to potty. No, I was thinking 
I'm thinking slightly later, Miley. As in, um, bang on my box, Sarah Miley. You oh know, gosh. working with the flaming lips, Sarah Miley. I... And her dead... And her dead pets. Yep. I can't follow this fucking conversation Why is that anymore. her fan name? I don't... What? I can't follow shit. I can't so fall asleep So basically, Miley Cyrus did a 90-minute oh, album so with the done. Flaming Lips as her backing band under the name Miley Cyrus and Her Dead Pets, and it was real bad. Yes. Like, admittedly hilariously bad, so, but, like, still. So much so that her label allowed her to release it outside of her contract. <laughs> like... And, and, like, she's signed to Columbia, so it's not like it's, uh, uh, like, <laughs> it's not like she's, like, out of any particular, like, uh, <laughs> agreement within the big music system or whatever. I didn't say, I didn't say it was, like, unfun. For the I'm just saying that it's not good in a conventional wow. sense. Rip. Rip. Oh well. Rip. Alright. Like, Lulu, I will make more arguments for it actually being good. Uh, okay. Okay. Music time is over now. Shapes and Forms time is over now. You can, uh, find me on Twitter at planet underscore Jane if you want to learn about when we will be live. But it's the same time every week. Excuse me. 9 p.m. to midnight Eastern time. 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. Central, and I don't know what that is on the West Coast. Probably like 6 to 6 to 9. Nice on the West Coast, I think. That might be wrong. Yeah. Anyway. Um, yeah. Yeah, that was our show. We do this every uh -huh. week because we are gremlins who live in your computer. Um, uh, yeah. If you would like to support the show, you can subscribe to the channel, or uh, so we you can, can reach our uh, subscriber goal. Yeah, we don't have one of those, but yeah, no, we have Patreon one. Goal. Patreon goal. Uh, Patreon goal. Yeah, our sorry. Patreon. Our Patreon is also in the link under so, the viewing window, yeah, and if we sorry. if we get to ten dollars a month, we will buy a GeoGuessr Pro subscription and do a GeoGuessr stream because we love you. But anyway, that's... Because uh, we hate yes. ourselves. We love you and we hate ourselves, yes. And we're going to go to Russia a lot. We'll probably go to Russia a lot. Um, oh, boy. That is, that is Shapes and Forms for this week. Do any of you have anything you need to, you need or want to plug? Uh, my Twitter is at notconvincing. I'm um, going to go to Disney World. No. My handle on literally everything ever is Tracebeak. That's T R E speak. I'm not on the internet. That's not it's a fucking lie. You're on Twitter at, at sci-fi nerd. <laughs> yeah. Did it for like, you. Exposed. Doxed. You're actually more you're online than me. Just fucking doxed. <laughs> been fucking doxed. But yeah, like uh, I don't know. Well, yeah. oh, I here. also make music, and also Jane makes music, and Trey makes music. I listen to music sometimes. And and Wynn occasionally listens to music. <laughs> and also, Jane writes anime reviews, and I sometimes write anime yes, reviews. Yes, I write and, anime uh, reviews. Uh, can you tell that I'm trying to, like, get us to three hours? Because we're, we're at two minutes, 58, or two hours, 58 minutes. Let's <laughs> just uh, cut it. Let's no, just... no. I'm going to no. tell everybody that they can read my anime reviews on geekgirlauthority.com. Yeah, they can. and I'm at a... And I uh, write for them anime something reviews under my real name. I'm linking something in chat. I also make music at planetjane.bandcamp.com. Shredney makes music at silenceandsecrecy.bandcamp.com. And there might Trey, be a new project, which Trey, I'm not telling your, you about. Uh, your Bandcamp URL is Traspeak at Bandcamp, right? It's it's Trevor whatever. Trevor -E whatever. B O R W H A T E V R. Don't uh, add another e in the whatever part. It's only two e's. Yes, only one e in the whatever. The second e has been jailed, and he knows what he did. 
Uh, I also write reviews on analysts, <laughs> which you can read. I, mean, I wrote true. a review of Sakurako san The Beautiful Bones. That show is AKA pretty the all bone right. Fetish anime. She's bone very, the bones. She's very horny for bones. That is, that is true. <laughs> She's and on got that note, boner for Lady Bones. fuck off. And on that note, fuck off. On that note, my live timer says we have been live for uh, exactly three hours. So goodbye. Yeah. Later, y'all. Thank you. Stay oh, hydrated, stay bot. Hydrated bot. <laughs> Thank you. Here, I'm gonna, Good night. gonna put him on screen for a second. Good night, everybody.